Good evening, everyone. I hope you're enjoying that adorable performance by little Ruka over there. Um, he had some catnip prior to the stream starting today, so that's why he's extra, extra cute right now. And I want to say before saying anything else, thank you very much, Guy Perfs. I saw that super chat right before I started. Thank you so much for that. I appreciate it. And you said, can we see the Ruka first? Of course you can see the Ruka first. Here he is. Oh, we don't get the music on this screen. But you do get a full screen shot of Ruka. Or maybe I can just make Ruka really, really big here and just bring him over top of me. There. No big deal. I hope you enjoy this, Sky Perps. <laughs> Ruka's being very, very sweet today. So let's see who's in here. Oh, and I'll also get you on my mug, Guy Perps, in just a sec here. Wednesday again. No, I'm not Wednesday. I'm just Megan. But I'm just wearing the dress that I wore for my Wednesday costume. Am I doing a Ruka cosplay? Hmm, actually, yes. I think I am. That's a great idea. Thank you. <laughs> I don't have little white mittens, though. Okay, he's looking very, very fine today. I must say. Hello, Jajo Pajo. Marshmallow. Hold on, I'm gonna write Guy Perps on here. Andrew Lima, hello. Antonio and Ren. Ruka Sniper, hello. Def Destroyer. Maro Merlo. Fat Freddy. Hello, Javelin, how are you? Hello, Vitor, and Dear Marks, Manuel, Josep, Guy Perps, the Joker, OZ1, Slappy, AF. Hello, Victoria, and Ron, Arcady, Fox Mulder, Max Justice, Sebastian Nunez, Private Account, Tertia, Hello, Conk, and Panda, Olympia. <gasps> Stay up there. You stay there. Um, hello, Defcon and Sade Valdez, Brian Sanders. Hello, Black Rhoda, Small Tank, Brucey, hello. How many of my little Ruka Club members are in YouTube chat today? Just seen a couple so far. Hello, Mark and Adita, uh, Daniel PC, Galaxy MK, Small Tank, Burgomir, PG Wolf, Cody English. Hello, Black Azard and Rebel, uh, Uno, Ahmed, Isaac Gabriel, hello, uh, Peter Dylan Beck, Tim Wolf, Michael Thompson, Sirius, Leandro, Mr. Boom, Devil Child, hi guys. And in Mixer, hello Picketing, Aided, and Prophet39. In Twitch, hello Walder, Seven Psycho Man, I Count Lamon, Road. Hello, dear Marks and Walder and Daphne. Hello, Noob and Tad. John Croft, Angel Wing, Brucey, Escort, and Taylor Nader. Hello, White Noise and Draw You Not. Nice to see you guys. So, welcome back after three days of no streaming. I am, of course, playing Fallout 3 again. I can't stop thinking about this game. This happens all the time when I play an epic RPG. I can't fucking stop. I've been pouring over uh, the, what the NPCs said to me about whether or not I should blow up Megaton or not. And I've decided not to. Last time, I decided not to because I liked them there, um, but I'm pretty solid in my choice now. So, uh, you've got your game running now. You made a melee and a rifle guy, and you're playing them simultaneously. Melee is OP, though. Yeah, I've noticed the melee is OP, though. That's why I'm hesitant to play it in this game. Even though I'm car currently carrying a sword, a baseball bat, and a ripper. I'm not a melee class. I'm a crit. High AP, expert vats. We'll see how that turns out. Okay, you guys, let's change to the game. Um, hello, Tristan Miller. I actually just realized that one of my lights is turned really, really low, so I have to just turn that up. Uh, give me one sec to do that. I 
I think. Yeah, that looks right. Okay. I have this really, really awesome LED panel that you can do really yellow light or really white light in. Had it on super yellow. So let's switch here. Uh, crit high AP vats equals sniper. I'm, I don't want to play a sniper. I played sniper to start off with in Fallout 4, so I'm thinking like small guns. Um, I might consider some spray and pray or whatever, but okay, let's switch here. There we go. It's looking good. Oh, and my top super chatter guy perps. Thank you very kindly. It's showing up now, finally. Let's see. <laughs> Can't stop, but I didn't finish Witcher yet. Well, Witcher isn't giving me Fallout dreams. Dreams about killing innocent people. Mm. Megan's being a gunslinger, not a sniper. Yeah! Oh! I think Ruko is expecting a treat, so let's not disappoint him smile. I also think Ruko is expecting a treat. Alright, let's give him one. Let's switch to Ruka Camp. Oh, where is he? Ruka! Oh, you want your treat? Angel's giving you a treat. Go back to your bed. Go there. Thanks, Ruko, my man. We um, did a YouTube raid once, and uh, I got everyone to say Ruko or Ruka loves you. And this one streamer just didn't know it was Ruka. He kept saying Ruko, so Ruko kind of stuck. <laughs> it's perfect. He is a little bit of a Ruko. Okay, so the desktop audio is working, and you can hear me. Okay, let's press continue here. Fully automatic weapons in Fallout 3 are strong. I have noticed I do have a an assault rifle, like a 556 one. It's pretty damn good. Okay. We want so Megan and Ruka. Guys, perhaps another super chat. You want Megan and Ruka? Well, thank you very much. Just wait a second, Ruka's eating his dinner right now. You might be able to hear him. He's knocking his uh cat food out of his cat tree. Hmm. Okay. Hello, uh, Phoenix. Did I get all the DLC? Yeah, I got uh, the Game of the Year edition. Or Ruka. Ruka bought me the Game of the Year edition. This is where my game crashed. Yeah, and I think I walked into the sewers too, so I gotta level up. Um, someone was saying last time that I need high explosives. Um, a certain high explosive, so I'll go to like the next next level, like 25 or maybe 30, I don't know, uh, to deal with the Megaton bum. So maybe we'll go 25 or 30, let's see. I really put up medicine because I'm often low on stims, so having high medicine skill uh, determines how much hit points you'll replenish upon using a stim pack, etc. So that's unusually high, I like it though. Uh, small guns as well, I should bring this up to 50. Small guns is my skill. And speech up to 50 would work as well, but... I also am always low on money lately too, so I think we might need to bring Barter up to 40. I don't know if that's actually going to save us anything, truly. Hi, Will. Oh, Joshua, you want sneak? Yeah, I'm not a sneaky character at all, but that probably would benefit me because I'm sneaking like across an entire field and I'm getting caution. Frog Raider, you've been subbed on Game Whisper for six months. Thank you so much. You guys are so wonderful. Um, I remember when I signed up for Game Wisp. Oh, everybody signed up um, for one of the tiers and you guys are so wonderful thank you for doing that that really helps me out um, it's it's a subscription service so you're just saying you will give um, me a certain amount of money based on the tier per month and you get some benefits and one of the best benefits is the Ruka points and sometimes they go through and sometimes they don't so if they don't go through please tell me and I will have to manually add them frog thank you very much for that it all adds up, seriously. It helps me with my stream quite a bit. Game Wisp. That's right, Dev Destroyer. 
Oh, well, you just wanted to ask me something. Can I create you as a wrestler on your um, WWE 2018 game? Yeah, as long as you make me humongous with huge, huge muscles and really, really high stamina stat. Yeah, I would love that. Hi, Alfred. Thank you. Hello, Anissa. Will I play any PS4 exclusive games? Yes, I'm sure I will. I definitely will. Does Ruka use bats for treats? If he did, I would ban him. Okay, let's put in... Oh, what was I getting again? Repair probably is important too. Fuck, I don't know what to choose. 25 gets me into easy or average locks. I think I can do very easy and easy. Probably the next level is 35. Uh, repair will help me maintain my weapons or science. I can do easy uh, science terminals, I think, now, too. It's very hard to choose here. Uh, let's up the sneak, because I suck at sneaking. But I also wanted to bring explosive to 30, because I wasn't sure. Let's just do that. Okay, my next skill. I think that I might be missing out on a lot of opportunity. Um in speech to with this Black Widow thing. 10% damage against male opponents is no joke. Most of the people I'm fighting are men, so I'll probably get Black Widow. But if I do decide to get Daddy's Girl, I will get bonus in medicine, so that'll bring me up to science or no, not explosives. I was thinking explosives. Is there one that boosts your explosives? Oh yeah, five points explosive, because I don't know if I need 25 or 30 yet. Lockpick is 25, 50, 75, 100. Okay, thank you. Rosa, no, I haven't dyed my hair. It might just be the white balance. Toughness, uh, you gain 10% to overall DT. Ooh, yeah, I probably need that. I'm dying pretty quickly. Lead Belly, Gunslinger. Your accuracy in bats is significantly increased. So this is what I wanted. I use a pistol a lot. Accuracy in bats would be a big deal, but do I want to waste this turn on that one? Swift Learner, I could get the third level. So let me get 10% more to XP. Ooh, 10% toughness. No, let's get Black Widow. I think that there might be some interesting stuff that we can do with that one. Okay, so now, what am I doing? I'm very low HP. I've just come in here probably to escape. Uh, I was getting attacked out there, so what am I even doing down here? Maybe I can quick travel out of here. I would like to go back to safety. Uh, my world map. So to recap what I did last time. Oh, I can't fast travel from here. Awesome. Let's see if it's still dangerous out here. Hi, Manito. What I did last time is I progressed the main story a little bit. So. From Megaton, from Moriarty, we heard that my dad was uh, doing something with this radio host guy in DC area, so GNR Building Plaza over here. So we went there, we spoke to him, and I think he told us that our dad moved on to somewhere else. But my next destination is to go to uh, Museum of Technology. I don't remember what exactly I'm doing, but on top of that... Last time you might remember that I killed an Enclave soldier that just seemed to fall out of the sky. And people in the chat were saying, oh, that's a glitch. You shouldn't have seen him yet. So as a result, I'm carrying Enclave armor. So I just really need to get to a place. See, look at this. DR21, DR4. Like, I need to get this stowed because I'm not going to be able to learn how to use power armor for who knows how long. Eventually, I'm going to get to a place called the Conclave? Not the Conclave. Uh, the Pentagon? <laughs> I don't remember. There's some type of Pentagon-y place that um, all of these Brotherhood of Steel guys live, and one of them will teach me how to use power armor at the lab, and I haven't discovered any of that yet. So, currently, we'll just dial it back a little bit and deal with our Megaton stuff. I'm going to see if I can disarm the Megaton bomb and see where it goes from there. Don't take any more XP perks. You will reach the game cap for the story if any were done, so all the XP is wasted. Thank you. Yeah, I wasn't sure because the, the level cap got raised to 30 uh, and with the DLC, and I wasn't really sure if it was going to get raised again. Um, if you see a, a cow fall from the sky. Yep, glitch. Yeah. 
A citadel, yeah. I, I couldn't remember the name, Dermarks. It's been three days. It's enough just to wipe that from my memory. Okay, so let's go there. World map, megaton. We're gonna disarm that bomb. Oh, this place is depressing. I need someone to heal me up. And every eye shall be blind okay, you better not fucking attack me when I do this. Attempt to disarm the bomb. Oh! Oh, that's it? Every ear oh, shit. To hear the Report to Lucas Sims' son, Harden, in Megaton. Women and okay. I honestly thought the children of Adam were gonna come down on me. Now, uh, we watched his daddy get killed, and then I went into his home and stole his bobblehead, and his jacket, and his hat. So, I think that I'm actually the sheriff now, judging by the way I look. But apparently not. I actually have to report to this little twerp. Somewhere out here. Where are they? Oh, what the hell? Power of the Atom there. Oh. I went the wrong area. He's inside here. Citadel is Pentagony. Thank you. Black of Bagley, you're supposed to blow Megaton up, girl. <laughs> hey well, did there. you blow up Megaton? I couldn't do it. Whatever you want, I don't have it. I like to roleplay to an extent in these games, but I actually... It's not just that I like these people, it's just that I do feel like they're they're useful. So, it's 50-50, these people are useful, and I also like them. Just so you can't say I'm playing a sociopath character. I have feelings about these humans in this residence. I like Andy Stahl. Okay, the guy I'm looking for isn't in here. How did I get a, uh, get the sheriff's clothes? Well, I I gave him the the detonator that some crazy guy in the bar gave me, and then he confronted that crazy guy, and then the crazy guy killed him. You did it! You oh! disarmed that thing. My dad, he he would have been real happy about that. Thank you. Mm. He wanted you to have these, a key and the deed to the empty place up behind the brass lantern. Well, there you can we move go. In there, if you want. Oh, and talk to Mora at Craterside Supply. She can help you decorate the place. <laughs> Excellent. Well, I knew I was going to get a house here eventually, but I didn't know how. Okay, I got a property thing, so where is my home? So she didn't uh, shoot the sheriff, but she did shoot the deputy. Angel, that's incorrect. <laughs> I think the deputy is outside. Isn't he that robot? Where did I buy your feelings? You've been on eBay for some. You asked Rosa, but she had no idea either. <laughs> I think you're barking up the wrong tree. Hi, Mika Mika. Um, you had a memory wipe once. You learned how to make bathtub gin. That's, that's a memory upgrade. And Rindo, I'm playing on very hard. Okay, so what is the thing that I'm trying to look for my house? Investigate Lucy's message. Okay. My house, I guess, isn't on here. So let's look right here. Lucy, Mr. Burke. That one doesn't have a description. That's a pretty good idea. Oh, these ones don't have descriptions either. Oh, the armory! Hey! I've been trying to fucking find the armory for two streams. Men's restroom, megaton clinic, water processing, Lucas Sims. My oh, my megaton house. Okay, it's actually right behind me. So that should be easy to fucking find somewhere. Oh, Xbox, so oh, Xbox, why do you delete all saved games, the most important oh. of them all being Fallout 3? Crying face, crying face. Megan, you're lucky. Oh my god, that sucks. Thank you very much, Guy Perks. Um, I do have some advice for you, though. Have you tried taking out the hard drive and hooking it up to your computer and running undelete on it? Because I have um, transferred a 360 save 
to PC for Skyrim a long time ago, and I don't know if that means that the save game would be transferable from this game to PC, but if you could maybe do that, I, I think it's like only if you haven't overwritten it. Thank you very much, Cypress. So in your Witcher 3 stream, a strumpet just meowed at guilt, and you cleverly responded, Is that because I'm wearing the feline armor? <laughs> DJs, are you watching my Witcher 3 playthrough right now? I honestly don't remember saying these things, but thank you for reminding me. I'm, that was a very innocent question. <laughs> hey, I have a... Wadsworth. Hi, Drake Bones. Uh, Paladin Caesar, what am I drinking today? Um, I'm drinking rum and ice with a splash of eggnog. So it doesn't, if it doesn't mess up Quetch, it shouldn't be a problem. Well, I hope it works out for him. You should try Googling at Guy Perps. Let's talk to our Wadsworth. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Wadsworth, your personal robotic butler. I am here to look after your needs and to keep you happy and entertained. What can I do for you? It'd be nice if I had a second robot called Longfellow. Where can I buy more things for my place? I'd like something to drink. I'd like a haircut. Oh, okay. Certainly, I am programmed with a Sounds multitude nice. of hair-shaping scenarios. If you would care to choose one, I would be happy to replicate it for you. Okay, oh, look at this. See, I think I look pretty fabulous right now. No nonsense, but what if we went fully fucking nuts and just shaved our head? I don't think it matters, because I'm always wearing a hat anyway. Mm, maybe we'll upgrade from Domestic Goddess to Seductress. It's just one more hair bump. Yeah, let's do it. And I like my hair color. But we could go red. There we go. Yes. Oh, that's easy. Okay, tell me a joke. Two atoms are in a bar. One says, I think I lost an electron. The other says, are you sure? To which the other replies, I'm positive. I haven't taken chemistry in about ten years, so... If there's anything you require further, feel free to ask, madam. Uh, you want to watch my Witcher 3 streams, but you haven't played the game yet. Oh, uh, yeah, play the game before you watch. It's it's such a good game. You can't spoil it. It's it's a once-in-a-lifetime thing. Hello, John USA's. Drake Bones, no, I don't speak Russian. Sorry. Okay, I got two bobbleheads. A uh, medicine one and a strength one. I'm pretty sure I found the strength one in the sheriff's house. Okay, I'm really happy to have my own place here. Everything's going to be safe. I'm going to store my enclave armor and all the garbage that I've been collecting. Where is the safest place to store an enclave armor? A uh, table? No. Oh, a spare bedroom? Holy shit, I'm rich. This would be like 1.2 million dollars in Vancouver. Okay, there was free shotgun shells. Let's put away a few of my things here. So goodbye, Enclave. Now I have so sort of more space. I also need to uh, fix a bunch of my armor. This level, uh, or this leather armor that's DR6 right now. I think it's when it's fully healed. It has like 14. And this jumpsuit is also pretty decent. I'd prefer to use this, but maybe I should put that on still. And I'll probably get... Uh, I don't know, it's hard to decide which I should keep with me. Science plus five. I can't see why I need to carry that right now. It only weighs one, though, so it's not a big deal. Same with this. I shouldn't be looking my, in my apparel um, for things to put away. One stupid thing I'm carrying is a fat man. I have four mini nukes. I don't anticipate needing this right now, but when I come across another behemoth, I might regret this moment. So, if I put it away. Um, 
Everything else is just heavy and stupid. But... Yes, I'm on part 14 of your playthrough so it makes sense you wouldn't remember all your puns, such as we're off to see the Witcher. <laughs> I didn't remember that at all. <laughs> Thank you very much, DJZ. I appreciate that. Um, have I ever played Red Dead Redemption? If you like Grand Theft Auto V, you will like Red Dead also. No, I haven't played it, but I am looking forward to the new one. I'm sure I could try the, uh, the first, is it the first one? I just hope that the horses are good in it, because I know it's like a cowboy game. If it's like Roach, then no. All right, I, I think that I decided that I want, wanted to put away, um, wait, did mini nukes weigh anything? No, just have high value. Otherwise, I'll just go to Moira and we'll sell a bunch of stuff and see if she can repair our armor. I think that's the best bet. You haven't played Red Dead Redemption, but you played Gun on the PS2. What is that? <laughs> Do I speak? Parcel tongue. Nine. Where's Moira's? Crater side supply is where I'd like to go. I think it's over here. Until the day of division. Until the dawn of your return to his <sighs> Um where does she yeah. live? You need something? That's the Church of Adam. It's been a few days, you guys. Okay, that's the entrance. That means to write myself here. I need to take this ramp up. Yeah, supplies there. What is between me and Vancouver? Uh, the Strait of Georgia. Here we go. The horse control is very good in the first Red Dead also. Okay. Drake Bones, how do I feel about the Russian people? I oh, have I no can't wait to hear how the repellent's about the working. People. <laughs> hey, I tested it out and it works just fine, but I could lie. Should I lie? I really don't want to do this quest. Because all I'll be doing is killing mole rats, so let's just fucking lie. Excellent. Finally, mankind will have a way to shoo away those annoying pests without resorting to cruelty or violence. Yeah. I'll just take that back for my final studies. Oh, but here. I've got lots of leftover chems from the testing. Maybe some of them are your style? Fuck yeah, I bet they are. Two jets, AP, two psychos, damage boost. Repellent stick removed. That's it? Okay. Let's do the second There's chapter then. There's a lot we don't know about Mirelurks and how intelligent and dangerous they are. That definitely deserves research. I hesitate to ask, but I'll need to examine the effects of serious physical trauma. Oh, I wouldn't ask if I couldn't fix you up afterwards, of course. And that should be it for the second chapter. Which do you want to check out? I'm gonna have to cripple myself? I'm gonna ha hate myself for this, but what do you mean about handling injury? Well, I never get to study anyone who's severely injured. Not without them crying to be fixed right away or trying to bleed out and all that. But obviously, you can handle a lot of abuse. So if I'm ever going to find a good example of human anatomy and injury resistance, it'd be you. Next time you get badly injured, return here so I can examine you before I heal you up. I mean, you're going to get yourself hurt anyway, right? I'm just going to go hurt myself outside. Okay, um, what could be possibly worth breaking my bones over? Did you know when bones break and reheal, they grow back tougher? In a way, you'd be repaying yourself. Once I make sure you survive, of course. But in a more tangible way, I can give you a modified environmental suit of mine. How's that sound? Yes. Great. Wow, what a great research assistant you are. I mean, really, that's dedication. Demonstrating how to withstand pain by getting injured? Wow. When you're ready, come back here with some oh, serious injuries. Oh, what the heck? Here's another Maybe one. I want to be on the mug, lol. First time for everything. <laughs> I'm level 22, about to get enhanced feline armor. Oh, enjoy your feline armor. I love the feline armor so much, because if you watched how I played Witcher, it was like 
wrist-breaking amount of flicking the camera around and rolling. Like, fuck parrying or taking hits at all. Feline armor really got me there. Thank you, DJZ. And yes, I think you are trying to take the mug. I will remove Guy Perps. Yeah, as you guys noticed, we I finally got Super Chats showing up on the screen. So there's in the corner is top Super Chatter. Corner is the other type of donator. Uh, she loves the feline armor because she's a crazy cat lady. No, it's because I liked... I like the look of it too. <laughs> but I think eventually at the end, what armor did I end up getting? Mandrake? <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> Um, hello, Innerbite. Uh, full loin, the streamer is not Russian. No, I'm Canadian. Hello, AF. Ian, yes, I'm on Twitch, too. And Mixer. She is a Neko Mimi. It'll update in a sec, it's just taking a moment. Why do so many people think Megan is Russian? Well, I mean, ethnically I I am Eastern European, but I don't I don't really think I specifically look Russian. Do I look Russian Russian? <laughs> I guess so. Thanks, Sith Lord. Thanks, Drake. I know um For two. And I'll take notes and fix you up. I'll be waiting here with plenty of bandages for you. So don't worry. Just go get horribly injured. Oh, and be careful. Spasibo. I know spasibo. <laughs> and be lad. Let's talk about the serious injury. I hear you're the person to see about buying stuff in my house. I don't really want to fucking furnish my house right now. Um, about the guide. Let me see what you have for sale. What do you okay. need? Hi, shotgun man. King V, it looks like that woman has a mustache. Yeah, unfortunately, with the sh uh, some of the shading on these characters, the women do look mustachy. Mm, I look human, thank you. I've always wanted to look human. Let's go to her ammo first. I certainly need these stims. And what else? I need 44s. Oh, she has nothing. I need the shoddy shells, but my shotgun is mm, pretty fucked. So let's compare my ammo. 44 wise. Do I have any anything that even uses a 44? No. My energy cells, though I have plenty. Shotgun shells 48. That's enough for now. So she's useless for ammo. Let's just focus on what I'll be selling her. Darts? Yeah, have them all. She can also take- Oh, don't take my missiles! I have one missile launcher and it's currently at a radio tower where that enclave uh, uh, soldier fell from the sky. And I should sell these because I need food to eat. Won't be using those right now. And now let's take a look at my weapons. What do I want to part with? I suck at energy weapons, but I have a ton of ammo, so sometimes this does work on raiders really well. I'm gonna choose between the Ripper, which does 13 damage, and the Officer Sword, which does 7. I just want to get rid of the heavier, slower thing for that. And then we'll look at apparel. I don't think I'll be selling it in my apparel. Aid-wise, though, I need to get rid of a bunch of crap here. Oh, really no crap. So miscellaneous it is then. Card of cigarettes, certainly. Food sanitizer. I don't know if this was something that I just had to obtain and not carry with me, but it said that it would make food more effective with me. Oh, uh, I should buy the mole rat stick back. That's a good weapon whenever you have to fight mole rats. Won't use up any ammo. Mole rats always two head kills. Good idea. Then I will buy it. Hello, Will Gaming. Hello, Combat Wombat. I am. <laughs> um, do I play Skyrim? No, I played it a long time ago, right when it first came out. 
I play like I was so insistent on playing Skyrim immediately when it came out. It came out for 360 first. So I played 360 version and then I transferred it to PC and finished it on there. But I stopped playing um when the the house building DLC came out. So I never saw any of that. I started playing the vampire DLC and it was kind of lame, so I, I think it kind of ruined the game for me. I didn't like it at all. I think we're okay. I'm still getting 137 caps from her. It's not the worst thing. But let's accept this. Get Good out of here. Good hunting! Oh, actually, let's see if she has that mole rat stick, because I didn't see it. It would be under weapons. Repellent stick. 168! Alright, dear Marks, I'm trusting you. <laughs> Megan was a console peasant. Yeah, I, I was. I started out. Um, oops, not cancel. Good hunting! Console games are fantastic for you if you don't have enough money to build a good computer. Or if you don't want to deal with, like, setting stuff up and crashing. It's just, that shit just works on consoles. I need to get my equipment you got repaired. Cap? So we'll see how much she'll charge for my armor. 162 is not unreasonable. So leather armor will be... <laughs> this one's Faruka love you, Nukaruka. Nukaruka, thank you, Guy Perps. <laughs> I appreciate that. Hi, Pimo. It's going well. How are you? Um, Electric Devil, if I did my hair in pigtails, I'd be a dead ringer for Wednesday Adams. I was Wednesday Adams for Halloween, actually, in this dress. Mm. You started on PCs? Wait, your fault for selling it. If you didn't have to pay 168 you would not have sold it. Yeah, but I gave it back to her. I didn't sell it. <clears throat> that was to complete the quest. Oh, my trusty ripper. I hope I'll have enough. I think the most important thing is the leather armor or the armor jumpsuit. So, 33 caps to repair this. It'll go up 9% to DR8. This will go up to DR16. Yeah, see, that's a no-brainer. Now, let's double check that it has that. Oh, she can't repair past 54%. Okay. And this one, since I know probably... Oh, fuck. I only have 131 caps left. DR will stay the same. DR will be plus one. This one, damage will be plus four. Yeah. Okay, that's all I've got then. Remember, I'll buy whatever you're selling. Oh, it's because I lied. You were able to keep it, but you also did the quest. Yeah. I've been a big liar to Mora. So I have to go become seriously injured, 50% health or less, return to Mora with your injuries. Let's see what the modifications are on that quest. Receive a crippling injury. I know just how to get a crippling injury. Watch this. Oh wait, I'm actually already at less than 50% health. I don't know if I could wi uh, withstand a crippling injury right now. But I'm an expert at these. So I'll save before going out there. Um... Okay, we'll do it over here where we're not going to harm anyone. And I've got this little thing right here called a frag mine. So I'll save. We'll put the frag mine down. Wait, can I set this thing off myself? I can't remember. Whoa, maybe I can. I have to shoot it. Oh! <laughs> Whoops. I didn't receive a crippling injury. I just died. That was a bit too close. So let's put one down again. And this time I'll stand a little far back and maybe we'll just... I'm just gonna aim my left leg at it. So that just my left leg... And I'll, I'll even face... Oh no, I can't face away from it. YOLO! Oh! Oh, that didn't hurt me at all. Shit. Okay, let's do that again. Put her down. 
and blow her up. Oh! Maybe we need to be a first person for this. This is a bit too close! I didn't cripple myself, you guys. Okay, what if we go and let something bite our leg? Or if I just... No, you can't even shoot your own leg. We might just have to try... Again. Uh, being an expert at crippling injuries is not something to look for. Maybe in your part of the world. Whoa! Okay, how am I doing? Am I crippled? Yo, no I'm not. Maybe try jumping off high places. I don't have a grenade and jumping off high places would certainly kill me just because of my low health already. My health, you can hear my heartbeat going. Okay. I might have to just refill my health, or if I die here, then... Okay, I literally have one health. Oh, look at my hand is so close to being crippled. So it's not gonna work. Let's just go end our miserable existence. I'm gonna get up on the highest point. Kind of, uh... Not the highest point. Go! Oh, that didn't work. What if I fight this robot? Oh, that guy. Hey, that cripple me! Sleep so you could take more damage. Yeah, I could do that too. So I died, and we're just gonna go and find a higher hill and see if I can break my legs. Try some tricks on a skateboard. This look high enough? Mm -mm. Gotta get nice and high. In a completely different way than we normally get nice and high. YOLO! Oh, that would have broken my ankles for sure. Hey, I see a thing right there. I'll jump all the way down there. Ooh, yeah, there is a big set of stairs in Megaton. We'll go try that after. Let's see if we can Bethesda climb this. I don't have a horse, so I'm not going to be able to go straight up a wall. No. Okay, let's go jump off that big set of stairs. Eat some grub. Try the brass lantern. I might have to go sleep in my house, though, first. I don't actually remember where I live. My megaton house is this way. <clears throat> so easy. A very nice to make your acquaintance. I'm your new robo butler. Let's sleep until then. Do those count as death count? No. Death count zero. <laughs> Welcome home, madam. I'm fully healed. We're gonna break our legs. Does that seem like a distance? Nah. It's gotta be a good one. Like from way up there. Oh yeah, that'll be a nice fall. That might just instantly kill me, though. Deadly Angel, do I like the game so far? Yeah, this is a good game. 
I love New Vegas, so it's not that much different. It's just a... It, the atmosphere is different. I like that it's darker. It's not as orange. People aren't having as good of a time as they were in New Vegas. It felt like they were a bit too happy to be living there. It's probably just because of the, the gambling and stuff. And the casinos. But these people seem like downright fucked. Which I think is more realistic. Okay, I was hoping to get up there. Here I go. Oh, fuck. Okay. Have I played Singularity and Metro 2033? Uh, no, I haven't played any of those games, Joel. So... Let's just fall from a slightly less high height. Okay, that sounded like a bone break. Let's see. Fuck, what the hell? Really? I gotta do that again? What kind of asshole just jumps off of railings, breaking his legs? Okay, that brought me down to one health. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm just gonna die here. If it's only like an extra hundred caps for breaking your legs, I'm gonna regret this. YOLO! Oh, that didn't damage me at all. You already completed it. How do you know? Did it say I completed it? No, I, I'm doing this. Optional. Receive a crippling injury. I want the bonus, not the... Not the basic bitch. Goodbye, cruel world. Your neighbors are watching and shaking their heads, wondering about the loon that just moved in. <laughs> yeah. Okay, optional. Receive a crippling injury. Now, I know that if I jump down there, it's not going to be that crippling. Uh, use a fragment like you tried before with full HP. Okay, let's do that. I hope they won't be upset if I use it in town. As long as I don't hurt anybody. Like, I'm just over here. Yeah, let's put a fragment down. There we go. Should I... Maybe I should squat on it. For maximum damage. Now, it didn't give me the warning. Oh, I'm so close to being mangled. Okay, let's do it again. Little bit of this. Okay. Hi, my name is Megan, and this is Jackass. Fuck yeah, my right arm and my left leg. For Abjuas Day, let's go to Mora. <laughs> what do I look like with it? Oh, look at this. Quite a limp. Um, Moira. Moira is over this way. Yeah, Joel, I've heard of those games before. A lot of people re uh, recommend them. They do sound pretty good. Now, of course, I've uh, disoriented myself from that explosion. Oh, I see where I need to go. There. Don't worry, it's just a silly walk. Is this the fucking exit? No, it isn't. But it works. What? I have to wait out here with a broken leg all night? Okay. Fine. Now you have to wait until she opens up. Don't sleep. 
Oh, don't you worry. I'm not sleeping with a mangled arm and a mangled leg. But I will be right back, guys. I have to go to the washroom. Stay right here. I'll be back in just a minute. Okay, I'm back, guys. Poor Ruka, he looks like a slave for a good view. <laughs> yeah, he is. <laughs> Hi, Twee. <laughs> Hello, buddy. How's it going? I was Wednesday Adams for a. Uh, Halloween. If you want to see my actual Wednesday Addams cosplay, go to my Instagram or go back to when I played The Evil Within. You'll see the, um, the thumbnail maybe on that one. I don't remember if it's on thumbnail. On my YouTube channel. Okay, let's continue. Um, Megan in the Wasteland, you love this game. What do you... Oh, when am I going to do a ghoul cosplay? Look, I'm not that good at cosplay. I can sew and I can put makeup on my face, but to do like the peely, like silicone -y stuff, I have no idea. Be busy works. testing. Okay, Moira. Hi, Happy Fridge. Welcome. You're new? Hello, Clocker. <laughs> well, how do you feel? Oh, I really, it really hurts. Um, why not study injuries on yourself? If it had help, I could shoot you in the gut. You seriously want me to go out and hurt myself for your book? <laughs> okay. Oh, I know it does, dear. But it's for a good cause. Uh, try not to squirm so much while I take notes. Now, how would you describe the pain you're feeling? Any advice for how to keep it from being overwhelming? And remember, this is for posterity. The adrenaline helps, so does the fear of death. There's a lot of both. My only solace is thinking about inflicting this pain on people like you. No, we'll keep it polite. There's a chance that she'll give us money if we're nice. Ah, oh, yes. Uh, that makes a lot of sense. And it does help when you're sewing up wounds and setting bones, too. <laughs> that seems like it'd be tough to do alone. Luckily, I'm here to patch you up. Now hold still and quit fidgeting. Ugh. How can you be walking around like this? Um, okay. okay. I Good. even stitched a little smiley face in you to keep up your spirits. It's kind of hard to see from your side, though. <laughs> Here, take this environment suit of mine. It will help with medical tasks, and it should help prevent the effects of exposure, too. What does that mean? Two medics? What kind of medical suit? Environment suit. Okay, the last part of this chapter is about Myrlurps, right? Yes, knowing more about them can help people learn to avoid or even outsmart them. 
So I picked up this observer device to study them in their natural habitat. I need you to hide one in one of the spawning pods in their lairs. Yikes. Oh, I guess I'll try. The pay had better be worth it. I hate my lips. Well, you're working on that. I'll be following up on a lead I've got for a couple stealth boys. When you're done, they're yours. Okay. And who knows? Maybe we'll learn something useful from the Mirelurks. Maybe. Probably not. The Mirelurks are dirty, disgusting creatures. That's great. I recommend the nest at the Anchorage War Memorial. I knew a trader who talked about the Mirelurks down there. Just go inside and find one of their spawning pods. Probably down near the water. Put this observer inside and get out quietly. And be sure not to kill any Mirelurks inside their nest. If you do, it could ruin the validity of the study. Oh, fuck. Okay, good. So I need to wear the stealth boy that I'm currently hearing. Optional, do not kill any Mirelurks. All right. So I would like her to repair my shotgun. Unless it's a steaming pile of slack. In the event that I might have to kill a Mirelurk. So I have a... Oh, no. Repair service. I don't see it here. Combat shotgun. She can't do it because of 200... Fucking 18 caps. I need to sell her something. I don't know if I have anything. Absolutely. 200 caps. I only have 55 right now. I would have to sell her... Something very valuable, like my assault rifle, which I need. Hmm. Or my collection of mini nukes. That would help me. But I just don't want to. I know I'll probably need those at some point. Scrap metal, I think, is worth 100 a piece at the water supply place, so I won't sell her this here. Give her all my whiskey. So that gave me 48 caps. That sucks. Uh, hey, what's this? Oh, my first infirmary. Oh, these are plans for my house to build stuff. Cool. Alright. Let's accept this. Good hunting. And go and see the robot in my house. Come back Apparently soon. he has purified water. You have an uncle who's a Myrler. Bill M. You are an emissary from the kingdom of the Myrler. Surrender your sovereignty or face extermination. <laughs> Not too hard to exterminate Mirelurks. Okay, my house is always to the left or to the right? It's to the left. Right there. Where are you, robot? Hello? Good morning, madam. What can I do for you? Certainly, madam, here you are. One purified water, how about another? Certainly, madam, oh. here you are. Certainly, madam, and here another. you are. And another. Hit me again. Certainly, madam, here you are. Infinite? Certainly, madam, here you are. Infinite water? What the I'm hell? I'm sorry, madam, oh, my condensation bye. collectors need to... Oh, whatever. Okay, that's not bad though. Five, um, five of purified water free. Hopefully every day. So let's save inside my house here. I am either planning on going to two different places. For one, I want to go to the Mirelurk nest and plant that device for Moira. And the other, she did tip us off about a minefield, which actually I realized that since I lied, um... To her about the result of that minefield quest i think i lost the quest marker so i don't actually know where that is so instead i will do this one location is somewhere that i have been or close enough to little island in the middle of the lake there so let's go to dupont station i haven't been there either may have to swim or DuPont Northeast. I can go back down the road here and then fall in. But before I do that, I'm gonna go back to this doctor down here. Whoops. Let the men 
Women I think this is the doctor's house. Mr. Burke's house. No, that's not the doctor's. This is the doctor's. Attend now to the words of the prophet of Adam. Over here. There. So do I like franchises like Friday the 13th, Nightmare on Elm Street? Do the maniacs of these films frighten you? I don't really care for horror movies all that much. I mean, they're okay. I, they're not my favorite. I saw Friday the 13th for like the first time when I was a kid and it was probably the last Friday the 13th movie I watched. <laughs> All right, Doc Church, For patch Christ's me up. For Christ's sake, you don't look sick, and you sure as hell don't look dead. So why are you bothering me? I'm addicted to drugs. I can take care of it for you. For a price. That'll be 50 caps. Maybe the dent in your pocket. Uh, I'll think it out. Your choice. I'll go just... But an addiction ain't... Sweat it out. Okay, I need to buy some medical Planning supplies. Planning on going... He has 20 stems. Ooh, I don't have enough for these. I could probably buy three. Fuck! Like, almost three. I'll sell him some of my beer. And these blood pack that I've been keeping, I thought that I need these for crafting. That's why I'm not... That's why I'm not selling them. But maybe I should just put them away for crafting. I have 12 jet, they weigh nothing. Lunchbox as well, that's a crafting material. I'm not sure where I'm carrying that around. Well, at least I have enough now. All my money. You done? Good. Mm, okay, see you later. Try. I'll try not to hurt myself, but I think I have to go back to my house now and sleep. Because I've jumped off that balcony. You forgot how hard it is to make caps in this game. Fallout 4 throws them at you. Yeah, Fallout 4 throws a lot of really awesome stuff at you. Wait, crafting is not big in Fallout 3. You can only craft weapons. So why am I walking around with blood packs? I think blood packs should go in the fridge. Uh, my fridge is over here. Look at all this food! I'm gonna take that all. So, goodbye blood packs. Something else I wanted to put away. Nothing. Keep my scrap metal in my fridge. That's a warning to you, Wadsworth. Good morning, madam. Do you have what any water? Do? I'm sorry. Never mind. Okay, now we're just going to see the Mileworks. Mileworks. I was gonna sleep too, but I think sleeping is for uh, sissies. For me to be able to get to these Mire Alerts, I will have to either start here and look for a waypoint. Oh, the Citadel is right there! Well, I don't need to fucking go to the Citadel from up here. I thought that I was going to find it on this side. So, in fact, I could actually go to the sewer way station and walk straight there. Let's try it. Might be safer. There might be some lower level enemies. Possibly. This is the area in which I found that Enclave soldier, I think. There's a very convenient bridge over there. And what I'm mostly interested in doing right now is going to loot for ammo and supplies in some of these abandoned buildings. I think this might have been the one that I cleared the... Yeah. I already cleared the assholes out of this place. But we'll just double check that they didn't leave anything behind. 
So I hear... Oh, an ant! Do you have projectiles? You better not. No, no, don't come here. Oh god, fire ant probably can shoot fire. But he's a little bitch who I can just snipe from here. So let's switch to our laser rifle, which I have a lot of ammo for. And do a little bats. His lowest thing is this torso condition, or is it head condition? Well, we have a higher chance of hitting this, even though it isn't- uh, no. I'd prefer to frenzy him. Critical strike on his antenna. His head is crippled. There you are, these are tough as fuck. Those monsters, Whoa! They're, they're gonna get me. These what? They're ants. Those things, they keep coming. They scare me, make it stop. Where did you come from, little boy? Oh, shit, hey kid, it's okay, I'm a big tough lady. I can take care of you. Or, hey, calm down, it's gonna be okay, I promise. I'll just say the strength. You look stronger <laughs> than all the other grown-ups. Can you... Can you protect me? Certainly. I'd like to help, but I need to know more first. No, I'm not gonna ask for money from this little kid. Those... Big things. They're all over Great Itch. And they killed everyone. Please, mister. Please find my papa. Oh, it's papa? Great. Well, they're big, ugly things that crawl around on six legs. They got huge teeth and skitter around grabbing everything in their path. My papa would always say they're fucking ants. Well, that's what he used to call them anyway. I just call them fire ants. What are they weak against? Are there any special ways to hurt them? My papa had a gun. He said it hurt those things. But he said they were the dumbest fucking ants he ever saw. He kept telling everyone to shoot for their antenna. Hmm. Whatever that means. Okay, we'll do it. Have they always been around? Let me ask something else. Um, I'll look for your father. You will? Really? Thanks a whole lot. My house is the one closest to the huge sign and the old diner. Please, find my papa and make him come back. Okay, anything else you can do to help might save lives. Well, I don't know if this will work. Nope. All I got is what's left on my back. Is there anywhere you can hide? Well, there is the personal shelter next to the old diner. Yeah, you should Papa hide there. Papa always said to stay away from it. But I guess it's supposed to be safe. I'll head over there and wait inside. Hurry back. It's one of those suicide booths. Okay, let's use... Oh, now it starts to spew fire. Let's shoot for its antenna. Um... Please don't post spoilers or, um, yeah. No spoilers, Papillon Warrior, please. This is a blind play. We got a crit. He's eating bullets like a fuck. Charging up my AP again. Let's get one more shot to his antenna. Really? Okay, maybe it's the wrong kind of gun. Maybe they like... Mm, assault rifle, 22 or 30. Let's do this. Don't know what the accuracy is like on this thing, though. Still the same. They have low AP. I have to shoot them. Oh, boy, that worked. AR it is. You have to tell them spoilers will be timed out, too. Yes, please. If you post spoilers... I can't be responsible for what happens to you. You will die in seven days. Just kidding, you will just be timed out. I'm gonna go loot this fire ant and see another one of those bitches down there. So it's got ant meat, which gives me HP plus six, and this fire resistance plus 25. I'm gonna be consuming that fire resistant 25. 
Uh, where is that again? Fire Ant Nectar. Intelligence minus three, agility plus four. Okay, let's put that on number eight. For when I need it. And we'll quick save here. So little boy is in there right now. That's where he said he'd be. This little ant. Oh yeah, he's stuck in the ground. That's a... Oh fuck, where is it? Oh, oh my, I didn't know that they were subterranean ants. It appears to be stuck in the floor. Okay, let's just ignore it. <laughs> Whatever. Fallout oh, 3 is so buggy. Honestly, I like the I like the bugginess. It makes just for interesting silly things to happen. Uh well, I have a PS4, that's right. Hi, Rogue Man Rock. Oh, there you are! Welcome back to the world, fire ant worker! Taking my fire resistant medicine right now. Got it. Oh yeah, he's frenzied and is dead. Ooh, nothing on him. So this quest that I'm on... Find Brian Wilkes' father. Probably he's in there. Grey Ditch, I guess, is the building? Yes, they have discovered Grey Ditch. I can hear them. Hiding in a bush? Jeez. Camper. Gotta take a stim here and get them reapplied. So stims go on for that ant thing. I guess I took it already. Just to prevent some damage here, I'm gonna take a medex. Cover myself and purify my Okay, so the antenna here. Oh, he's frenzied. Good. But doesn't mean he's not gonna frenzy at me. That's the problem. Oh, he might frenzy the other one. I don't know where that one came from, though. They can fight each other now. Battle ants. Great, great. This is the best. Oh shit, I'm out of ammo. Now he's gonna come at me, I gotta make sure they're sufficiently killed there. I'm detecting another one in that direction. And another one in that building right there. And we do not talk about Ant Fight Club. There he is. It's just a solo, though. <clears throat> I have some pretty good accuracy with this pistol, actually. Okay, I don't have any nades or anything. I was gonna keep shooting at his face. And hope I hit the antenna. Oh, that's a soldier, too. I got more AP now, good. Go for it. 36%? I wanna get the other one into the arena. Come on. Come on, come this way. The arena of fire. Where's the other one? We're gonna get them together. Come here, you little fucking ant bitch. Hey. Come together. Yeah, come here. Oh my god, that one is powerful. Maybe he knows what I'm trying to do. Oh shit, here it comes. 
I'm gonna try to frenzy him as soon as I possibly can. And 57% better than 49. That's not good. Let's switch weapons. I don't have any ammo for that. My hunting rifle will probably work. Laser pistol, not so much. Ooh, I have not used pulse mines, but I think that's for robots. I remember now. Hello, Frederick the Great. Hmm. That's all we got. Recovering my AP right now. Hey, get over here, fire ant soldier. I'm back up against a wall, I think. Very low AP. I need to take a bunch of jet. Oh, whatever. I'm addicted to jet. Hey, it's supposed to give me bonus AP. Yes, he's frenzied! Get out of there! You know what's gonna happen! No, you're supposed to be fighting the other ant. You motherfucker, come here. I'm gonna get these two together. Save me some ammo, you ant bitches. There. They might see each other. Look, they're looking right at each other. Here it is. Here we go. We have Fire Ant Soldier in the right. He has two health bars. Fire Ant Warrior. Gonna kick his ass. Totally. And he's down. But I got the XP. Thanks a lot. So now that our AP has recovered and he's fully frenzied, I'm just gonna have to go for headshots, I think. Oops, I shot his torso. It's fine, it's fine. Get back here! He's a goner. Two more shots. One more, okay, okay. There we go. How'd we do? Just a little bit of ant nectar. So we're still looking for this guy's daddy. I pulled out two of the ants out of this building. Gray ditch. Seems to me that there are two more here. Good. We'll do the same thing. Gotta reload. To wait for them to come to me. I got Medic's Withdrawal. That's going to give me a negative stat. Uh, effects? Okay, Charisma, whatever. I don't need Charisma to fight. But, Agility and Minor Radiation Poisoning. Can I can solve that? I can solve Psycho Withdrawal with more Psycho. This Perception thing sucks, because I think affects your uh, accuracy. We'll just solve it by taking more drugs. Um, and then I'll take Rat away. Ooh, my radiation is quite high. We'll take the rest of it, and we'll take a Rat X to prevent some. I am so wasted. Yeah, my guy is totally reliant on, uh, on chems here. Fire ant worker, all right. I'd like to pit two evenly matched workers against each other. He's frenzied! You're gonna kill him, don't shoot him again. Okay. Whoops. I actually wanna make him fight. There he is, there he is. All right, he's like, fight me, bitch. Now let's, let's frenzy this one too, or at least give him a better chance. For our little little worker right there. I think we'll do some headshots. Oh, you know what? What if we crippled this ant? No, they, they use projectiles. It doesn't matter. 
Okay. Whoa, don't shoot at me. Oh, they're dead. I hear another contender. Right over there. Just a soldier. Psycho is a hell of a drug. Anything that makes you do 25% more damage is a hell of a drug. Not interested in frenzy. Just gonna go for the kill here. You wonder if flamethrowers hurt fire ants? I'm gonna guess no. We gotta cripple this baby's head. Not... you know what I mean. Come on, this is the crit! This is the last shot. Explode it. No. One more. <laughs> Too bad. The father could be inside this building right here. Wilkes House. Uh oh. Daddy dearest. Fought off three giant fire ants. Not bad. But he died. And I got his house key, so I guess we're gonna have to loot his house now. Ooh, assault rifle. And lots of ammo. No wonder he killed those. The uh, AR, I've noticed, does way better damage than my hunting rifle on them. Oh, uh, you know what I, um, I meant Death Destroyer. <laughs> But there better be some epic loot in this poor old shack here. Maybe upstairs. He had a 32, but also a box of 44 ammo. So surely that means you have a 44 somewhere. And here's another garden gnome. Oh, speech plus five. Do I have somebody that gives me speech plus five already? Speech plus two. Yeah, we'll take that. And this bed is free to sleep in? I'll definitely do that. Oh, let's just have a nap in his dead dad's bed for like four hours. Hmm. Oh. Well, Will, I'm not really on PS4 ever, so it probably won't get to me. <laughs> the best way to send screenshots of stuff is to, uh, like, my Discord. But if you're having to send it through PS4, I'll just see it the next time I, I'm on there. Uh, hi, Mateus. I think we got everything. Milk bottle. I don't know if there's actually milk in those. Alright, his son is in that thing right there, but... We're gonna find out what he's hiding in the shack right here. Ooh, a very nice lab. Dr. Lesko's recording. Maybe I'll listen to that. This could be the fifth time I've forgotten the code to my desktop terminal. I really must learn to be more organized. The password for my terminal is Formicidae. How hard could that be for me to remember? Note to self, destroy this holotape as soon as move to new lab is complete. <laughs> it sounds like Farnsworth. 
Okay, what the hell is this? What's Dr. Lesko doing? For Mess's side. Activate science robot. Yeah, science robot command input, personal notes. All right, first, oh, pod empty. Robot out of range. Where did I go wrong? Batch A27 is a complete failure. Oh, splice the correct genetic instructions. Ooh, I wonder if this has to do with the android quest that we're doing. Perfect specimen for my experiments inside the Marigold station. Set up shop underground. He needs a little bit of last minute programming on my robot. And it's going to be ready to perform injections. Okay. What are the dangers? Playing God for one. He needs a proper test subject. Interesting. We're going to do that. Hmm. Well, we'll go and investigate. That sounds fun. We know how to kill those ants now. And I'd rather do some quests that are within my abilities right now than going straight to the main quest, which seems a little bit too strong for me. It's kind of hard to breathe in this thing. <laughs> Come on, tell me already. I have some bad news for you. Oh no. What happened? Hmm. I'm sorry, but your father is dead. He's... He's dead? I guess I already knew. Besides, I'm too tired to cry anymore. Um... I'll stop whatever started this, I promise you. You gotta stop it, so this can't happen to anyone else's family ever again. I wish I had met you a long time ago. And then maybe my dad would still be alive. Thanks for doing all this. I'm feeling better now that you're here. Okay, so what happened to some of the people that lived here? Nah, go ahead. It's just nice to talk to anyone about stuff at all. He was a strange man. He paid Papa some caps to help him build a shack and carry a bunch of junk into it. Ooh, it's his Papa fault. Papa called him an egghead, but his head was shaped regular, so I didn't get it. Do you have any idea when he was doing Great Itch? I imagine Dr. Lesko is the reason that all the fucking fire ants are here. Nah, he was a nice man, but he never wanted to play with me very much, and we barely talked. All I know is he was all gone when the ants started showing up. I think they got him too. Okay, mm where did he stay? He spent all of his time in that shack next door to my house. Every time I'd sneak in there, he'd be sitting at that funny-looking TV machine with the green words pushing buttons. I don't know. All kinds of doohickeys. Boxes with lots of lights, some funny glass bottles. Oh wait, he had a big, funky, shiny man too. That was kind of neat. That's relevant. Where is the shiny man now? Yeah? Tell me about the Brandis family. Well, there is Will. He was sort of my friend. And then there was his dad and his mom. Right across the street, actually. It was pretty swell having someone to hang out with so close by. Yeah, Will was super nice to me. He was like a year older than me, I think. He even shared his comic books with me. We explored pretty much every bit of Greyditch we could find. I think that's why the ants don't bother me. I have good hiding spots. Hmm. Yeah. All right. Well, if, if everyone left because Greenwich, of ants, that means there's going to be some useful stuff people left behind. A bunch of shit people left behind. Exactly, Brian Wilkes. Exactly what we needed. Give the kid a cookie. That would be nice if we had cookies. It's 11.40 p.m. right now. We should wait until daylight. Be easier to see some stuff. Because I want to go in everyone's house and loot their leftover belongings. So he said that that was his house right here and his friends lived across the street. So we're going in here. 
And possibly the ants have... Might have come back. I did see a little dot on the map. Goodbye, Rosa. Oh, yeah, I hear that ant. Where is he? There you are. Surprise, motherfucker. Oh, it's an ant worker. Mm, I don't think I'll waste an antenna. We'll shoot it point blank. Oh, no. One more shot. Barely any. Okay, so they had nothing in their house, but I didn't actually really look. So let's go back in there and go upstairs. Oh, nothing up here. About in the backyard here. Is there more there? Oh, hello. One there. And I think one's coming over there. Let's try to frenzy it while we're up here. And then we can watch them fight from up here. Safety. Oh, it's frenzied so soon. Okay. Where's the other one? I see it. Should be right over there somewhere. No, I detect two of them here. But where are they? Oh, there he is! Come get me. Come fight this other fire ant. <laughs> he is coming out here. World of Ants Ant Hunting Simulator. Only... Oh. What the? You can't shoot that high. Okay. There we go. Which one's gonna win? That one? Oh, no. That one. Because that's a soldier. We'll help this one a little bit just by shooting it a bit. Get some nice little headshots on it. <laughs> uh oh. Yeah, that one died. One more shot. Boom, there we go. I still hear them. Oh, that's a small one. I never did go and check out the diner. I think we should go there next. And then I'm gonna activate the part of the quest that said we have to go and search for what that scientist was doing. And we're gonna go clear ants out of um, some other place. Now we know their weaknesses and their propensity for gladiator style combat. Everything is clear in here. I got a couple Nuka Cola What's from this there. Funny suction hose for? Uh, nothing. Don't touch that hose, especially not to your face. <laughs> oh, children. So those, investigate Marigold Metro Station. I don't even know where Marigold Metro Station is. It doesn't even say show location. Could be around here somewhere if I just look around, so... I came from... that direction, so I'll just keep heading south. You stepped in a fire ant nest once, in real life. How did that work out for you? I got a single bite from a fire ant once. I would never, ever, ever do that ever again. <laughs> It was in, like, a zoo where they had a tropical enclosure and you could walk through and, like, look at all these tropical birds and plants. 
and the ant just fell on me and I guess decided to fucking bite me. take another shot I think out of vats here unless I get the crit. Even my crits are garbage. Oh. Fucking fire ant soldier motherfuckers. We'll vats him at this distance. Come on, give me lucky crits. Lucky crits, no. I thought that if you crippled their head, you would also cripple their um, fire spewing ability. more stopping power on this gun. Or a gun that does better against armored. Shit, these things are everywhere. I will reapply that fire ant nectar to my number 8 button. Since I have enough now, I can actually use it. Oops, or now. Um... We'll top up our X, our HP here. Oh, it's pretty good. HP plus six for eating this fire ant meat. I'm just going to suppose that the place I need to go is a bit south of here. Because I'm heading south anyway to get to the citadel. Yeet. Hey, that looks like a building I can go into. I like the look of those doors. Very welcoming. Although I think I have been here before. This might have been the place with the... Yeah, this is one of the super mutant that we killed. And glitched through the door, I think. Yeah. Everybody... Oh, he's a back... How is he alive again? Remember we killed him? I'll get bonus XP from here. I'll just fucking kill this guy. This is great. What are you gonna get? Like 32 XP? I'm sorry. You never tried to be my friend. 18 XP, that's not very good. And I don't want to search him. What if I go through that wall? Okay, I didn't. So there was a lot of, like, pretty cool stuff around here. I just left for some reason, probably because I ran out of stims before. I'm gonna keep heading south, because I do want to just get to the Citadel. Although, shouldn't a subway station kind of be a little bit obvious on the map? Wait, Marigold Station, that's where it is. Oh, it's right there. Okay, I'm setting my marker for here. It's actually northeast. There's no way through this place. I have to go around. Oh, 
I'm gonna switch to my 10 millimeter for this guy because I just it's a waste of money to be using that other gun on him Especially when it's only giving me half XP. The bigger guys give 18. Oh yeah, there we go. Marigold station. Finally! Here we go. Let's go find Professor Farnsworth down here. Oh great, I hear more ants. Let's check my stats, what I'm actually doing to myself here. Three agility minus ones. That's awful. I really gotta heal. Or take more jet medics and alcohol. Let's do that. Oh no, I'm out of alcohol! <laughs> what am I gonna do? I'll have to find some. Hmm. <laughs> I am not Dean Douglas. <laughs> not specifically. The dark green part of the map is hard to navigate. I agree. Who's that bad boy? Fire Ant Worker. Whoa, nice! Good shot. Very good shot. Very, very, very good. Oh! There is some mist rising from the ground here. I'm a bit worried. Oh, you guys, I never checked out that suit that she gave me. Environment suit. Med plus 5. Radiation resistance plus 30. So if I have to go to a very radiated area, that's useful. Okay, I'm detecting more than one of these bugs. That's just a worker. No big deal. Here the other one right behind that door. Hey Beepo. Am I playing from Steam? Yes. This is a Steam game. Okay, let's open it up. Have a feeling I know what's gonna be there. Yep. Oh, a soldier, shit. Reload. So, he's hiding from me. I just ate some fire ant nectar just now to get 25% resistance to fire. Once I reload, we'll do the bats on the head right here. His head should hopefully blow up. One more! Two more! Give me one more shot to his head. Fuck. Close one. Okay, got a metro ticket weighs nothing. Cotton of cigarettes does weigh. mines. More mines in here. Hmm. 
I wonder if we have to do anything with that. Hi, Melting Keys. Your laptop says Steam is offline, Michael Hansen. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> I wish I knew. Sometimes you can set your chat to be offline. Just make sure you're set to be online on your chat. workers down here. They're very weak. radiation level is high now and I'm pretty sh oh no look at all my things I'm endurance minus one twice agility minus one for alcohol withdrawal and soon to be jet and medics withdrawal we're gonna be in a very bad place soon unless I find more drugs or a doctor or some fixer which someone said may not even exist in this game Okay, I no longer have 25% fire resistance. Let me see if I'm heading in the right direction. says investigate the station and remove the source of the fire ant so I'm supposed to just keep following them and look for the source now is this the only way into this place came from there came down here yeah I'm heading into this area and I think behind me is probably dead ends no there is a way down there as well let's try this way first if I were an ant colony, I would probably choose this room. Here comes two at once. But where are they? Oh, they don't notice me yet. I'm hidden. No, I don't play in PUBG right now. We're just gonna check this garbage can and then we'll go up that escalator. I've only got 10 bullets left for this gun. This is not good. But I have a lot for my energy weapon. Hmm. I don't think that I should be using melee weapons against these guys. So what are my options? Hunting rifle? Can't use that. Oh, we can use the AR. Strategically, though. That's a fire ant soldier, so we want to get his antenna ASAP. Oh, He'll be 
be very exposed if he comes down the staircase right here. much ammo left. I have to put the rest of it on his antenna and hope that it works. He's frenzied. That might make him turn around. Nope. Fuck. And now I'm out of ammo. Only other option is a 32 bottle cap mines. View hunting rifle. Well, we'll just switch to our laser pistol and see how it goes. Okay, I've done a quick save. Let's go up there and YOLO it. Oh, there you are. Now, maybe I can cheese it from here if it can't shoot fire. I think it might be stuck. <laughs> yes, raise your head. Good. Good cheese bite. And I got a lunchbox in here. Sweet. <gasps> Grady's last recording and some more 32s. Okay, let's listen to this recording. If you're listening to this tape, then my brains are splattered all over a wall somewhere. And you've got a job to do. You need to retrieve the package and get it safely to Ronald Lauren and Gerner Shade. Tell him Grady sent you. To get the package, you'll need the key. I've stashed it inside an old fire hose case in some maintenance closet in Marigold Metro Station. The key will unlock the safe that contains the package. Look for the room marked by a spinning light. You can't miss it. Good luck. Spinning no lights. They won't find you too. Fire hose case in Marigold Station. So we're in Marigold Station right now. I'll have to investigate all the cases. Hmm. Hey, Melton Keys. Um. I put away my mini nuke because uh, it was too heavy. <laughs> I think I'll just throw them this time. Okay, we still haven't found the source of the fire ant invasion. Hi, Slinky Globe. But now I know where to go. There is another way back uh, that way. Before leaving this room, we have to look for any fire hose things on the wall. Have you guys given a thumbs up yet, Walder? I would totally appreciate it if you guys would give a thumbs up or subscribe to my YouTube channel. Or follow my Twitch or Mixer. If you haven't already, please. It would be very kind of you. Oh, this one's gonna bite me. It does nothing. It's the worst. No, my weapon is broken. Oh no. Now what? Am I gonna have to ripper it to death? <laughs> oh shit. I guess I have to use the rest of the hunting rifle on this piece of shit. He has my AP recovered. Just about there. Two shots to its head only. 
least we crippled it. It's not enough. I'm gonna take that fire ant nectar. Go for headshots again. I missed one. Landed the other, but barely did anything. Oh no, I got backed up against a wall here. You piece of shit, Ant. Okay, he's frenzied, but that doesn't help me right now. There's no other fire ants. But it does kind of confuse them and make them a little placid, actually. But I should probably frenzy always first. They they don't seem as crazy about attacking you when you frenzy them. So I have four bullets left. I might have switched to my shitty old 32. Now that I've got a lot of ammo for that. Hey, no, it's not 32. What did I pick up a ton of ammo for? The 44, which I don't even have. You hear ants in there. That's a big boy. Holy shit, why did he have to reload right there? Let's get out of here. Okay, probably vats him as soon as he comes around the corner, but with three bullets. Good luck. No chance. No chance for a frenzy. Fuck, I got no ammo. <laughs> okay, let's put down a mine. Right there. <laughs> oh no, another one! Look! <gasps> okay, they're both gonna blow up then, as soon as they come to me. Oh! Hey, it frenzied him! Good! That might mean that it's gonna fight the other one in the hallway. Oh shit, it's still coming at me. All right, I'm taking a fire ant nectar. And we're gonna run by here and not get burned to death. Hopefully I can get the other one to come through here. Or just get that one to walk over the- Oh my god, we're gonna get stuck between them! And I'm just gonna run. Come on, come on, the other one has to come through. <gasps> it's also frenzied. We have a chance at making them fight. Oh god! No! <laughs> hey, there's something on the ground right here. Come on! Fuck, that didn't do anything. We need to take something for our health. Ant meat. Fire ant nectar. Nuka cola for sure. How? How are you doing that so fast? Oh shit, that's a dead end. So is that. I might be able to get out of here. you startled me. You really mustn't creep up on people like that. Doctor, let's go help me. There's fire ants behind me. 
I didn't expect to bump into anyone alive down here. That is precisely why this is the ideal place for my work. Do you realize you're trampling about in a delicately balanced and highly sensitive experimentation area? Whoops. Mm. My experiments are of a complex nature and would take a scientist to explain. Oh wait, I'm a scientist. How marvelous. My foray into reducing the girth of these insectoid creatures is of utmost importance. I intend to generationally reduce their immense stature by way of a pre-birth induced mutagen. Isn't that clever? Uh, sort of. Hmm. Well, let me see. Well, you start with a generation of very large ants. You simply inject the current brood's eggs with an engineered mutagen. Then, the next generation should be smaller. Do it enough times, and you may be able to reduce them back to their once original tiny size. <laughs> Are you in where your new ants breathe fire? Well, this is rather embarrassing, so you'll have to forgive me, but it appears that I've made a slight miscalculation in my mutagen samples. Instead of lowering the size of the ants, the brood hatched and developed a, a new biomechanism. I call their genetic aberration pyrosis, the ability to emit flame from their bodies. I may be able to correct this error, but I can't get near my equipment. Oh, great. So all that needs to be done is eliminate the remaining ants? I'm afraid it's not that simple. The mutagen has already been injected into the ant queen. She has enough in her body to last for years. My problem right now is I can't reach my terminal to make the proper adjustments and repair the damage I've caused. So what exactly do you need? My portable terminal is set up in the hatchery chamber near the Ant Queen. If I can reach it, I can continue to work on improving the mutagen. Queen's your concern. Why not deal with it directly? Why not just kill the queen and be done with it? If I were to do that, months of data would be lost. Mm -hmm. No, no, the queen must remain completely unharmed. Your objective would be to eliminate what I call her quintet of nest guardians. Ooh, filthy little abominations. I'm gonna need the nuke for this, I bet. Uh, how will this undo all the mayhem you've caused? I've rigged the equipment at my portable terminal to emit what I call oh. an inhibitor pulse. Once I send this pulse, all of the remaining ants will lose their empathic link with the queen and frenzy destroying each other in the process. So that's all there is to it. What do you say? Well, that sounds great, actually. Uh, if it'll stop the ants from burning down Grey Ditch, I'm in. I'm gonna need some serious incentive. Oh, books aren't gonna buy me new ammunition. I need more ammunition. Why can't man follow the ants' example? They work together as a team, every waking moment dedicated to the colony. They require no wealth or material items. Everything they need is provided for them by their fellow insects. But I digress. If it's payment you need, all I can offer is one of my mutagenic bio-enhancers. Um... I've managed to isolate some of the fire ant genes and distill them into human-safe genetic enhancers. I can inject you with one of these formulas and you'll find Ooh. yourself with either enhanced strength or enhanced perception. All right. Not only that, but you'll be somewhat more resistant to fire. How marvelous. Deal, but I need some serious enhancive, in incentive, AKA Cash. Yes, I suppose you're right. Science must learn to acquiesce to your standards in order to advance itself. I was merely going to offer up one of my mutagenic bio-enhancers, but I suppose I could up the ante. I will also award you with my old lab coat. It served me well over the years, and you may find it useful for your own experiments. Okay. You will? How marvelous! Be careful, my friend. The nest guardians can be quite tenacious. He can't sell anything. Can he? Okay, I'll loot his house. Let me in there. They're coming. Close the door! 
Oh god, okay. We're safe for a moment. Now let's find out what he has in here. His conductors, just a little bit of ammo, and mill pistol. Is Megan wearing a Wednesday Addams outfit with a Witcher pendant? Yes. <laughs> Hello, Justin McGregor. So where am I now? I'm in Marigold Station in the hive of the ants. And we're either going to kill the ant queen or we're going to kill all the small ants and then inject it with some ant mutagen. But it's going to all depend on whether or not I can get enough ammo and stuff to kill them. Oh, really? Can't sleep there? Well, I might just kill the scientist. Okay, it says caution, but I guess that means he can't see me doing this. This guy killed people. How do you know he won't mess up again? Well, I don't really know, but he is offering a prize. So I'm just doing it for the prize of enhanced strength. Oh, fuck. Is it all the way to the left? No, here. Closer. Closer. There we go. Garbage. Oh, where the hell did he go? Oh my god, there's a hole in the ground right there. That's gotta be it. Well, he's not gonna know I sleep in his bed. Oh, I can't even do it. He doesn't let me. Well, I have an idea. What I might do is leave and come back. So how far did I actually come in here? I came in through the top here. It was fairly easy just to run through. I don't know if the ants will respawn, but uh, it might be possible if I just ran right through, I could come back here. I'll have my fat man gun and my missile launcher and potentially more money um, to fill up all my ammo. Or we could just hop in there right now and see what happens. I'm going to see what happens first. And we will repair this gun real quick. It's already pretty well repaired. So I'll repair one of the shittier ones with the other shitty one. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> oh. Well, down we go with no health. Maybe, maybe this is not a good idea. Probably, probably not a good idea. Oh my god, fuck. Let's just go. We're gonna die. And it's already in caution. I've got nothing here. No sneak skills. They do get some, some XP for something. Is the professor down here? What's this? I don't know if I can get by this guy. That is a, oh no, a guardian. That means it's gonna be a lot more powerful. So do I have anything stupidly powerful that I'm holding off on using? A repellent stick, but that's for mole rats. Mm, just mines, those kind of suck. Bottle cap mine, however, 300 damage. Let's put one of those down, oh God, go! Holy fuck, that frenzied it, but it didn't really help me. Oh god, it's almost dead! And so am I. 
One more shot on it. It's going to be fine. 45 XP for that shit. And I had to waste a bottle cap mine. I do have enough bottle cap mines, though, I think. Oh, look at my stats right now. <laughs> Minor rad poisoning. Okay. Wait, did I not pick up any stims? Yes, a single stim. <gasps> you know, oh my god, I'm gonna use a stealth boy here. I was gonna save it for the Myrlarks place. Myrlarks. But if I use it here, I could sneak all the way to that thing that kills the ants. Let's do it. Just don't detect me. We'll move faster if I put my gun away. Oh my goodness, hopefully your perception isn't good. It worked. Device? Porticon. Protectron. Okay, there's three different things there. What the hell is that? That must have been the one that I killed. Optional, do not harm the ant queen. El oh, eliminate all five nest guardians. I might be able to turn this robot onto attack mode. Investigate to remove the source. Okay, let's talk to Protectron. I'm sorry. Voice signature, not recognized. I don't have the skill of 50 to unlock that. Let's see what my science skill is right now. 26, not a chance. Holy fuck, look at that thing. That's the queen? He said that he had some type of device that would cause them all to frenzy and kill each other. And here I am at the Ant Queen. I'm sorry. Voice signature not recognized. Oh, activate mutagen tank. Here. No? Not letting me. Oh fuck, I'm in danger now. Oh my god, the queen is gonna come eat me. That sucked. <sighs> okay, I can kill all of those assistants, but I can't talk to the robot. Hey wait, where did I save last? Right when I walk through here. Mm. Wonder if it'll let me fast travel out of here. No. You guess cheesing is next. Ah, uh, that was already like semi cheesing. But if I turn on the stealth boy and also put down the mines. I think that I have a better chance of getting them down. So here bottle cap mine. Stealth boy. You don't need anything from the cave, you just need to kill the guardian ants. Yeah, but why did he tell me I could turn on some device? I gotta get it to come here. Nice. 
I'm making a ruckus. Look! Shit. Okay, I'm still stealthy. Let's go put the next one down. Oh, we only have two, enough for three of them. There is a fourth. I'm gonna have to somehow figure that one out. This guy is right there. Okay, come here. And then the gun that will take it out will be... Has to be the 10 mil. Oh, I can put frags down. That'd be nice. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, fuck! Hey, I think it missed the bottle cap mine. What the hell? Okay, I'm gonna hide right here. Maybe it won't see me. Oh, shit! Run! Run. You're totally dead. Fuck. I'm not stealthy because my pimp boy light is on. Hey! Is that why? Alright. We'll try without the pip boy light on. That's probably it. Okay, we will put a bottle cap mine on seven. Frags are on eight. That's already on one. Stealth boys really work that much on ants anyway. I have no idea. <laughs> we'll find out. Whoa, that was a good amount of damage I did. Whoops. I'll finish him off with my pistol now. Okay, good. That was an easy one. Let's save. Turn my light back off. Oh, two at once, two for one. Give me a two for one. Whoa, fuck, I just killed myself. <laughs> I threw it right on top of him. Good thing I saved. <laughs> Round 10. I want that two for one. I hope they're still going to be next to each other this time. Oh, God, there he is. Run. Yeah! He's frenzied. Oh my god, he might go and kill the other ants now. If he forgets about me, he didn't forget about me. I'll just have to dash his dreams. There we go. Let's save after that one, too. Okay, I got one more bottle cap mine. And a level up! What should I get? Explosives? No, I should probably get repair and medicine, since I'm dying a lot. And then we might get that damn uh, DT 10% bonus on the next screen. <sighs> hmm. But I do want to access that guy's computer. Hello, FFO nobody. Thank you for the host. 
Small weapons would be good. Would help me save ammo on my pistols since I run out of ammo constantly. Oh, um, ground control. You just got downloaded Fallout 3, but it's not working for you. Yeah, look for the Fallout 3 Steam guide, and there is a really well written one with pictures and easy steps on Steam, one of the Steam forums. And I think Der Marks might have followed it, so he could probably uh, post the link for you. But yeah, there is a few things you have to do, and then you'll get it working wonderfully. Uh, okay, so small weapons. Oh, it's already at 50. I'm doing not bad. Maybe I'll put 5 into that. But let's go 45 repair. Science. Was it 2550? 7500? Probably for lockpicks too. Let's bring explosives up to 30. Small guns, 55. Barter up a little bit. There we go. Okay, so gun nut will give me more points in small guns and repair. That's what I wanted. Hi, Red Raider. Possibly. But it did give us a few... Ooh, strong back! Yes! Of course I'm getting strong back! Fuck yeah, I don't even care what anything else is. Now, did I save after killing that ant? Let's do it again. Ooh, there he is. Okay, don't throw it right on him. Just right beside him. Ah. Now I'm gonna switch to my other frags. Come on. You can blow it up. It's fine. Come on. Oh yeah, he's dead. You had to uh, sell your soul to Bethesda to get it running. How'd that work out? <laughs> okay, how many mines do I have left? Am I gonna have to actually... F oh, one frag mine. I'm gonna have to fight this thing honestly. The last ant. And then there's also the queen. I The queen's also gonna attack me. Red Raider, your birthday is Thursday. You get Battlefield 2 tomorrow. Oh, happy birthday. Come on, Ant. Oh, it's plasma mine. Hey. On my break at work, watching the stream, congrats on being able to have Super Chats be shown. I guess I'll try to be on the mug again. Thank you very much, DJZ. I appreciate that. Let's see, does that make you on the mug? Yes, you are on the mug! Congratulations! <laughs> Thanks. Oh, Fallout 3 is good, Red Raider. Have you played it? Paul, wait, Pulse Mine is for robots. Plasma is for anything else. So I could use the Plasma Mine if this guy is not sufficiently killed by the time he gets... Oh god, he's down there. Okay, come on. Hey. I'll just put it here for when he gets up here. Oh yeah, he's gonna need it. Whoa! Yeah, that crippled him but didn't kill him. Got a, quite a few health bars to deal with now. Used up all my ammo for that, all of it. All of it there. <gasps> oh my god. I have nothing left, you guys. I actually have to attack this ant with a, 
A melee weapon? <laughs> this is so bad. Um. Oh dear. Okay, here he comes around the corner. That's the best way to attack an ant. It's by surprise. Here he comes. I'm gonna run right into him. I'm gonna kill you! Oh yeah, look at this! Look at this! Eat it, eat it, eat the ripper! <laughs> when you tell them to eat it, it always helps. Okay, we're good. Let's save. So, he said don't kill the queen, but he did say kill uh, her warriors, and we did it. Now I've saved, and no one can blame me for what happens next. The Ripper is completely OP, but only if you use it correctly. You have to you have to strafe around them, even though they have a very tight turning radius. And I actually thought that it would use its flame on me right away. But I have noticed one thing, is that when you're right next to the ants, they don't immediately shoot their uh, flame at you. It's only when you're like, the per- What the fuck is that down there? What? I thought that was the fourth one. I think I saved. I really- oh fuck, I hope I saved. Oh man, we're getting out of here. I've got nothing, you guys. Just the Ripper. And there's no way I could kill a full health ant. With the Ripper. Unless I can, and it is possible, especially with all my issues that I'm currently going through right now. Well... Let's, uh, take all the drugs. Oh no, first we'll save. Like that. Then we take all the drugs. Ooh, buff out. Um, I've become addicted to everything. Jet. Why not? Mentats. Radex, sure. That one. My leather armor is still the best bet, I think. I do have a pulse mine, but yeah, again, I can't use that on ants. Got excited there for a sec. Okay, this is my strat. I know what red X is for, Defcon. I'm just taking everything. Eat it! Eat the Ripper! Oh no, my web is broken! That was my ant strat. Let's see if it did anything. Okay, what else do I have? Oh fuck! My bare fists? A pulse mine. Okay, you guys actually want me to punch this ant to death? You saw shotgun shells in my inventory, yeah, but I don't- my- my shotgun is dead. <laughs> I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna have to punch him to death. I shouldn't have sold that sword. What was I thinking, you guys? Let's assess its health. Oh my god, it is almost dead. Okay. Here, I have a plan. I have a plan. I'm gonna save here. I'm never prepared, don't- don't ever assume my preparedness. Okay, here I come! You're gonna die, bitch! In a pile of your dead brethren. Oh shit. Will I just punch on him? Madigly, no! Jump over him! Ah, 
Now you suck at turning, you stupid. I'm gonna punch you in the thorax all day. How do you like that? Ants breathe through that thing on their butt, so he probably doesn't like that at all. Actually, is that his thorax? I don't know. I'm not a fucking entomologist. I'm the unarmed ant destructor. <laughs> okay. Um, we're to return to Dr. Lesko. Let's save. Uh, Megan, do you listen to yourself? No, I uh, definitely not. <laughs> okay, let's go back down. <laughs> Am I going up? No, this way. Hey, well, look at this little thing. So, I know he didn't want me doing anything to Queen, and there's the Queen. Um, oh god, what is it doing? It's coming at me, so I'm leaving. Holy shit, that thing is actually gonna attack me. Hopefully this reward that this scientist is gonna give us for doing this is gonna be so worth it. So let's take a look at that quest. Um, do not harm the queen. Mm-hmm, okay. I guess we're playing, um, unarmed for now, you guys. <laughs> okay. Where were you? Dr. Lesko is fleeing. From what? Hopefully not from me. There he is. Hello. I've detected some changes within the Queen's hatchery with my equipment. What's transpired? Hmm. My work is done. Oh, how marvelous. Please, tell me what happened. Come now, the faster you tell me, the faster I can provide promised payment for your services. I'm uh, killed them all. Then I will proceed to my portable terminal at once and make the necessary changes to the formula. Thanks very much for everything. You've been quite a useful lab assistant. I'm ready for my mutagenic bioenhancer injection and lab coat, Doctor. How marvelous. Here is the promised lab coat. I'm certain you'll find it quite useful. Which injection did you mm. want? Will it be the ant sight or ant might? I think I want ant might. Physical strength will increase my carrying capacity. Um, but perception is how far you detect enemies, and I think it might have to do with your vats, but I think I want physical strength. I mean, carrying weight is always best. How marvelous! Ant might it is! Mm -hmm. Hold still, please. Give me that injection. Also, I might try to pickpocket that gun off him. You have been granted the strength and flame resistance of the Great Itch. Fire Ants, your strength is increased by one, and you are now 25% resistance to fire. Sweet. So let's save and see if this works, because I like the look of that gun. Oh. And since we may not need Doctor... Oh, he only has... Please, you're spoiling my experiments. Well, I got his ammo. So oh, no, he took it back from me. I think I might just go down and observe what's happening. Down here. You believe you mentioned at the start ammo is scarce and need to be more conservative. You probably did, but I... There's nothing fun about being conservative. Time to start back at square one. Are you going to show me what you're going to do down there, or what? There was an opportunity for me to... ...steal that robot that he has, maybe, because back... 
above ground. Oh, back to the drawing board. Um, there was a, a robot, like, enclosure, and, and it said that since I got into the computer, I could change the robot's program, and if I could somehow steal the robot, put him in there, programming to be my companion, that would be cool. You can punch am ants harder with more strength. Yeah. <laughs> Walter. <laughs> Hi, prototype one. Okay, is that ant gonna just kill him right away or what? What is he doing down there? <gasps> I just want to watch. I'm not a weirdo. Just let me watch. Uh, prototype, I'm just out of ammo, that's why I don't have a gun. <laughs> okay, it does say I'm detected. Oh, now it says caution. Shit. So I think as soon as I make the ant aggro, he starts going in there and running around. But now I have to wait for that ant to de aggro. I wonder if there's any loot here. No loot, but I got a prime viewing platform. We're not gonna kill it. Yet. Okay, unfortunately I don't see anything that is actually gonna be interesting. So we're leave, and I need to very, very quickly get back above ground. Otherwise I'm totally toast. I've got no health, no healing ability, no ammo. However, what kind of lab coat did we get? Environment suit? Uh, less goes- oh, nice! Okay, 20% rad resistance and science plus 10. That's really good. This is rad resistance 30. That means now I think I only have to get my science up to level 40 before I can Pack average terminals with the lab coat on. Now Lesko, I still can't sleep in his bed apparently. You guys stay right here. I will be right back in just a minute.
Okay, I'm back. Uh, Dinorphia, is that a witcher necklace? Yes, it is. It was um, 3D printed for me uh, by Elguion, and I painted it and put little red gems in the eyes. Okay, so we're in this dude's lab, and did I thoroughly loot it? Yeah, I think I probably did. Hopefully the ants aren't still waiting for me <laughs> outside this door like they were before. That's why we're going to save here. Mm, and now let's check out my carrying weight. Oh, 270! No, that's my health. What? 270? That is my weight. Great. Now I can take all this dumb shit, like sensor module, stuff to sell that I'm going to really, really badly need. See, look. Lasko's terminal locked average. Um, what was my science again? Ooh, fuck. Bad. I won't even be able to steal his robot yet, anyway. Maybe this is a secret exit. Mm, I see an ant there. Oh, fuck! Go! Run! <laughs> Not the right place. But I'm gonna consult my map real quick just to make sure. Yeah, it did look like a dead end. Okay. I might have a plan. Pull the ant out. Run by it. And go in the loot room and loot it. Maybe there's ammo in there. Here he comes. What is it? Fuck, it's a fire ant warrior. Uh. Not a good chance here since he's coming up the middle. <laughs> very, very bad. Run! Go, go, go! He can't chase me! No, I'm gonna die. One HP. Is there a door? Oh, fuck, there isn't. Okay. Loot in here better be worth it. Guns, guns, guns. Where are they? Oh, hey, it's not a dead end. Oh, fuck, there's an ant coming. Nope. Still nope. Oh, God, here he comes. One small touch from an ant is gonna kill me! No! Oh, run up! Oh, I almost made it! Okay, I'm going straight through there. Um, but this time I'm just gonna just try and see if I can run because I saw a staircase going back upstairs. Time <gasps> to turn the mug right side up. But at home! You are amazing! Thank you so much for that! <laughs> you know what that means. I need to go and get your mug and just wait for this. <laughs> One sec. Fun at home, thank you so much. You're so generous. I just gotta detach my mouse from the thing here. It's dance time. You know exactly what time that means. Okay. One sec. This should work. I hope you liked that. 
Um, give me a second while I go and get your mug. And I got a little bit of cat hair on my mouth. Give me one sec, stay right there. <laughs> you loved it? Excellent. I think Rick liked it too. <laughs> and I think, here's Fun at Home's mug. The permanent Fun at Home mug. We are going to have a little shot out of it. Just for tonight. Just some tank array. That looks about right. Cheers, fun at home. Thank you. Oh, that's a big one. Mm. One and a half. Ugh. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I look like Cho Chang from Ravenclaw. Um. <laughs> Thank you. I don't know who that is. Megan is Asian. You agree. You usually speak in Chinese with me on Discord. <laughs> no. <laughs> Definitely not. <laughs> Fun at Home is so nice. Thank you. Let's get back to our game because I know Fun at Home wants to see how the hell are we going to get out of this little situation here? Um. I'm just having a little snack right here. I'm having some Soylent. So we will drink uh, our Soylent out of our fun at home mug and then we'll have some tea afterwards. <laughs> okay, you need a weapon if you're going to play this. Well, I don't have a weapon, so we're just going to have to deal. Fun at home. Very, very, very generous. <clears throat> okay, YOLO, that's not the right way. I'm just gonna go for it. It's gonna be in the hallway, but fuck it. We're gonna jump over its head. It's right there, go to the side! It can't turn that fast, okay? Got the first one? It's just like Mario. You gotta jump over it like that. I didn't seem good. Go! Go, you mad woman. Another one! Oh, shit the door. Go! Oh, fuck. Ah! Close the door! It can't open doors. It can't open doors. I don't believe it can. Oh, where the fuck is the audio? Thank you for telling me. When I go to the dance scene, it automatically turns off the, uh, the audio. Thank you. Mm hmm. Megan is half Asian, you just can't tell. <laughs> it sounded really funny, just my voice though. Well, sometimes we deal with that. Accidents. I've been streaming for just over a year now and sometimes we make the mistakes. <laughs> Um, Dr. Snake, you can tell since we speak Chinese. I don't. <laughs> I don't know any Chinese words. Not one. What do you speak, Dr. Snake? Do you guys have second languages other than English? Please tell me what you speak. I am curious. Ooh, Ted Mills, there we go. You should paint me one day. I have a very appealing face. Thank you. <laughs> I was trying to make a worse face for you. Oh, Granny's safe key! Yes! Um, Megan speaks fluent Mandarin. Mm-hmm. <laughs> In my dreams. 
Justin McGuire, you speak many second languages because you're a nerd. Oh, that's fine. There's nothing wrong with being a nerd. Some people are polygots. And some people are not. Now, I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna get out of this room. This is bad. Did I pick up anything good? Ant meat. For ooh, and fire ant nectar. Oh my god, one stim pack. Yes! That will give me just a couple extra tiny hits. Um, Dr. Snake, you speak French, English, Mandarin, Cantonese a bit, and Spanish, but it's not good. Oh, you guys. Hmm. Dr. Snake speaks parcel milk. What is that, dear Marks? Don't bring your private jokes in here. Take the lead pipe when you run out of ammo. I didn't even actually realize that was a weapon, but you're right, I should. Um... Arcadia speaks Japanese, Korean, and Tagalog. Well, then you guys are very talented. And when I do a language stream again one day, I will need um, your help. Harry Potter snake language. Oh, okay. Okay, we're gonna beat the shit out of these ants with a pipe. I'm gonna save in this door. Let's see what we can do. I have a good feeling about this. I've got my psycho on. Get your pipe out. <sighs> oh shit. I'm gonna beat you. Oh. It's safe. Hey, hey, hey. They left. So there's something that I need to look at. Return to little Brian Wilkes, yes. But I also got another thing that said get the guys. What was it? Get his. Oh, I have to say, listen to it again, maybe. If you're listening to this yeah. tape, then my brains are splattered all over a wall somewhere, and you've got a job to do. You need to retrieve the package and get it safely to Ronald Lauren and Girder Shade. Tell them Grady sent you. To get the package, you'll need the key. I've stashed it inside an old fire hose case in some maintenance closet. Okay, got it. At the old metro station. The key will unlock the safe that contains the package. Look for the room marked by a spinning light. You can't miss it. Good luck. And hopefully, they won't find you too. <clears throat> okay, room marked by a spinning light. I haven't come across one of those yet. But I do hear the ants in that direction. Let's see. Spinning light room. Oh, that's going to be the exit over there. Maybe, yeah. What do we got here? Oh, hello. This looks like an ammo stash. Oh, silence 10 mil? Sledgehammer, yes. Oh, yeah. Stims, too. Three. Is it my birthday? Um, Pradeepda, I saw you said I should read the Harry Potter books. I just haven't, haven't got to it. Alright, um, I feel like I backtracked a little bit here. I have, okay. Since I haven't seen a room with a spinning light, I'm gonna walk down here and then to the left. Because that'll be the last place that I haven't explored. And yeah, it is a dead end. But I think also he said the spinning light place was down here as well. Um, okay, there's two of them there. And I believe that's not the exit. Oh, there is a straight way. No, that's blocked off. Okay, let's go back here. Um, far turn next. Do I speak some Spanish? Just like four words. No spinning light there. I 
I've already fought my way through here. We're just gonna walk again to look for that place. Okay, that's the exit right there. Oh, I think the game has crashed. <sighs> yep. Uh, what are the four words? They are ba a la daresha. <laughs> Wait, e para a la biblioteca <laughs> and una cerveza por favor. <laughs> Okay, my game crashed. Um, give me a sec. We'll fix this. Yeah, I can only say go to the right in Spanish. I can't say left. Go to the library, yeah. <laughs> It's fine, I save off and we're not that far back. Oh, really? We're in this room? Fuck. Did I get this? Yeah. And the pipe? So I ran this way. I eventually found a locker with, um... A silenced pistol in it. Over this way. I think. Yeah. pick up the stims that were on the wall. Oh my god. No! Oh fuck, I've done this before. And I have died in the same place before. I deserve this. What's my favorite weapon so far? Um... Let's see. They're not my ideal weapons. The the hunting rifle has been doing the most damage, I think. The AR is good. The shotgun I like. Yeah, whenever I use vats, I can't use vats against these things because I it makes me stand right in the middle of their fire. There's no way that I can actually fight them in vats. I, I have to do the cheese way to fight them. And I'm not even trying to fight them anyway. I'm just trying to leave. I swear this was the exit. I, I did walk up here. And I saw the way to go. Yeah, it's up here. We're not gonna worry about this right now. About this treasure quest. Because I just I can't commit to it with um with how much health and stuff I have. times now I missed the ammo box? No, I wasn't looking for it. <laughs> but I did get the silence 10 mil. I hope. Yes. I want to repair this. Wait, it does six. It does six damage. The other one does eight. Uh, I don't know if that's actually that much better. I'll keep them both, but I'll use the one that does more. Let 
little boy is still inside that chamber? And he's got no parents and no one... No, I know what a TV dinner feels like. It was so weird. All of a sudden, the ants went nuts and started fighting each other. It was like they were totally crazy. It was really scary, but kind of cool at the same time. You know what I mean? Yep, it was all me. <laughs> okay, so... Glad you're safe. I wish I had something to give you for all the work you did. But I never really had much to start with. I guess now you'll be on your way and I'll have to try living here by myself. Hope you'll come back and visit someday. I can't leave you here alone. Let me find you a place to live. Yeah. Really? You mean it? Oh boy, thank you so much. I'll wait in my old house for you to come back. I need to bury my papa anyway. Just don't forget about me. Actually, I give up. I can't find anywhere that will take you in. Oh, I have to find a home for him. Okay. Any idea where I can look for someone to take care of you? Well, Papa always told me about my cousin Vera. She lives in some big giant mm. ship somewhere or something. Papa called the place Rivet City, but I don't know where it is. Okay. You're pretty swell for a grown-up. Well, I haven't been to Rivet City yet. And I want to see now if I can do anything inside this guy's lab here. Yeah. Nothing else. Oh well. And nothing of value in here. Oh, there. Now, did that conclude this quest? Find a home for him, okay. Now we need to do the Mirelur thing, but I'm gonna go back to Megaton first. Wait, did that little boy want me to follow him? I'm gonna find out. Hi, Philippe. Uh, broken Rolex. This is PC, and um, I'm only playing with anti-crash mod, which sort of works. <laughs> okay, you got gloves on. Holy You actually came back like you said you would. Did you find me a home? Not yet. I hope you found me a place to live. I won't give up, little Brian Wilkes. Now, last time I saw a place called Armory on the map, I had never been there before. So I do need to go there. Let's... Well, we'll go there after I go to talk to Moira. Or let's get healed up at the doctor first. I think that's more important to get all my addictions cured. <laughs> You'd best have cancer, because from the looks of you, you're breaking rule number one right <laughs> now. I can take... that'll be... I don't have 50 caps. Well, this might go better for you if you hadn't blown your money on jet, don't you think? Hmm. He won't do it. Oh, shit. I only have 11 caps. Okay, I'll sell him some smokes. Doctors like cigarettes. And cherry bombs. I don't know what those are for. I should sell these 44s, but I'm just holding out, hoping that I'm gonna find a a 44 gun. Okay, let's accept that. You done? Good. That'll be okay. 50 caps. Maybe. 
All right. I got some of this pre-war stuff. Should flush your system right out. Um, Arcadia's, yes, I'm gonna do it. You were just in the armory. You started a heavy weapons guy an hour ago. You were listening to my stream in the background. All oh, heavy you, weapons. Big baby. Oh. Can I get back to work now? Yeah, fuck off. Oh. What kind of Tampa heavy weapons um, are there early in the game? Okay, where is it? Where's the armory? Megaton House, Jericho, Mr. Burke. What the hell? I saw it before. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yes. But I'm gonna go to the supply place first. You are gonna start off with mines and grenades till you get your hands on a flamethrower. Oh, I did get a flamethrower early on too. But I think I sold it. Yeah, that's the probably the place you're thinking of, Dimmerks. But I got it. Ooh, very hard. Okay. Let's wait. Just a couple hours. Hi there. Hey! Book's coming along well, thanks to you. What's next? I never did think of stealing from Moira. Doesn't really have anything good here, though. Something. Now I wonder if it's like Skyrim that it doesn't let you sell stolen stuff to the merchant. <laughs> Let's find out. So are they intelligent? Do they have a leader? Some sort of king or priests? Mm. Why do we care if they're intelligence? They still try to kill me. Okay, yes, they're <laughs> jerks. But if they're intelligent, we can get them to stop and and train them. Oh, maybe we could even ride them. Oh, that'd be fun. Okay. Sure thing. Bethesda building. I don't know if I saw a Bethesda building. I was gonna get rid of these blood packs or put them in my fridge at home. This is worth a bit. Okay, she's gonna give me 93. Maybe she can sell me some ammo now. Ideally, I'd like some... Ooh, those are kind of pricey. 5.56 is really, I think, all I need. Oh, no, I think need 308 for my sniper rifle. I need to save some money, too, for fixing my Good hunting. other gun. I have 100 caps, so I can get my armor repaired again. Bit. That's more useful, I think. But unfortunately, she won't do shit unless I have 109 caps for my ripper. Fuck that. Um, I'll just leave for now. Rem and I should probably steal a bunch of stuff from her house. My eye on you. And then I'll sell it back to her and then she'll fix my stuff. Nobody sees me. Ooh, hoppy mask. <laughs> I don't think I want that. Okay, it's mostly trash up here. 
What's in our bedroom? Nothing great. Okay, I'm going to the armory now. Don't try anything. I wish I had pickpocketing skills. Just is my business. Oh, hello, hollow tape. What's this? I already have a copy of it. I wonder if they'll detect me behind here. Yeah, they will. I got. Them. All right. So the armory is apparently in that direction. So hey nice. Glad you're back. I don't know if it's up Hi or there. down. There's the saloon. That's the bathroom. It seems like it's like right here. There we go. Use key. I have a key. Oh shit. Okay, I'll save. I don't know what's gonna be in there. Oh shit! What? Oh my god, that's egg. Okay. Um, I do have a mine that kills robots. False mine. Here we go, come on. What the fuck? Everyone's attacking me now? Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Alright, just, just kill me then. Maybe I have to kill it behind closed doors. I'm still in danger? Okay, I'll try killing it inside there then. This is gonna be very, very difficult. How do you like that? Come in here. Save when I came out? Oh no. Now everyone's gonna be mad. Hey, but I'm back in here. Ooh, an SMG. Oh shit. <laughs> and it also saved right there, so that's really bad too. Oh, this is the worst thing to happen. Oh, 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 oh. The game loaded the auto save. When you exit the room, you have to load a quick save. Oh, so reload your quick save. I understand. Okay, so this time, I'm gonna do the same thing. See what that does. Hit the mine! Oh my god, that thing is a good shot! Okay, the armory or quick megaton. Yeah, this one. <clears throat> mm hmm. Okay, we haven't been in here yet. Good. It's like it never happened. Except it did, and I'm gonna I'm gonna finish it. <laughs> so as far as I know, this pulse mine does fuck all. But if I have to fight a robot, what am I gonna do? My AR. It can one-hit me. So why don't I go home and have a little nap and think about it first? And heal up too. So where's my house? My house is just right up there. <laughs> Alright, well I can't believe those guys got all aggroed from the town. Just because I walked in. Also, I don't remember where I got that key from. You're friendly, aren't you, Wadsworth? Good morning, madam. Heal me. What can I do for you? I'd like something to drink. I'm... What? You have your... 
yourself a fine day, madam. All right, let's go to bed. Funky times, that does sound like an excellent evening. <laughs> Welcome home, madam. No more bobbles for me. Oh, I know. I'm going to put a couple things away in my fridge. My collection of blood. Actually, I'm going to turn that in. That will give me some caps. Now, it might be a new day. I can get Good some more evening, water. Madam. I'm Shit. You have yourself a... Uh, laser and plasma best for robots. Yeah, I think I broke my gun, though, so I need to make some more money before I can get that fixed. I've got to go... Right there. It's just straight across. Yeah, you need something? Good to see you. I grab the bait grand theft bacon. Here's water processing. What do you need? Well, all right. Third, oh, Take it's only ten caps. caps. I thought it was a hundred for some reason. Hmm. Well. Now this guy's place was always eerily quiet, for it being a factory. Eerily quiet. Yes, that's locked. And yes, I can see you eyeing it. Oh, I wasn't looking at it. Okay, back to the armory we're going. It is a weird shaped building. Right over here, I think. And uh, oh no. I wonder if I have enough to repair my laser gun. So I'm not gonna be able to kill that robot without the laser gun. So crater side supply is just right down here. Whoops. It is the very symbol of Adam's glory. Hi cat dad. If you're still playing a good character, then red doors are off limits. I'm not very good, no. Hey, I thought I was just at the supply place. Is it not right here? Oh no, that's the children of Adam. That's a supply right there. My energy no, weapon. I th you got. I have 138. Ooh, she can only repair my ripper or my 32. How much would it cost to repair this? 348? I can't afford that. Hmm. We're gonna have to cheese this robot fight then with the Ripper, <laughs> probably. Or, um, up 26% my armor. The, the robot can one hit me, basically, so I have to cheese it so that I'm like running circles around it like those ants. In which case, my leather armor won't work since it's gonna one hit me anyway. 
The Ripper, however, does a lot of damage. So I choose the Ripper. She doesn't sell. Oh no, no. It's not gonna work. We gotta go kill Try. that robot. So proper save right there. I'm gonna equip the pulse mine. The ripper is on three. It should still be on three, yeah. I'll press three immediately. I'm gonna get all fucked up on jet? Buff out, yeah. Unfortunately I don't have any psycho. That would help me. Okay, here we go. Ready to die for your country, you commie son of a bitch. Running will only make the pain. That's supposed to work on him. Fuck! The bomb didn't go off. Okay, I think I have to actually like put it right underneath him. Let's try again. Zero deaths. Can't shoot me here. You gotta move forward. Okay. Now we're gonna jump forward and that's the shit out of it. Oh no. Oh no. Bad noise! Bad noise! sound <laughs> oh my god that sound <laughs> why the ripper really though the ripper <laughs> oh my god it sounded like a chainsaw versus an iron skillet <laughs> I'm sorry that I had to kill you guys. Look at that, he had all this stuff. What? Look at all this! Yoink, yoink. All of that. Wow. Um. Oh, now how you did that, before going in and using a stealth voice, sneak in, steal everything, and get out. <laughs> That's not my style. I can't open any of these computers or safes. Really? Well, we got a decent cache of weapons, though. I mean, okay, if that's average, what skill is required to open that? 27. I think you said 25, then 50 is to open average. Oh yeah, 50, okay. <laughs> Just for a little taste of that sound again. <laughs> now let's pretend like it never happened. I didn't do anything in here, you guys. Okay, I picked up a number of guns. But not a lot of weapon. Uh, not a lot of ammo, I mean. 
enough to repair my stuff or sell. It would probably cost more to repair this with Moira than to use it. See, the value goes down. Ooh, now I might be able to repair the shotgun. Finally. Good. Okay, I have this pistol. I'm gonna repair that. Oh, the hunting rifle too. There. How did Megan open the door? Don't you need a hundred lock picking? I don't know. I didn't even know where I got that key from. That's valued at 16 and 21. Let's see if we combine them. Hmm, they're worth 60, okay. So it is worth it to do that then. Now I have two different assault rifles. For some reason, Chinese assault rifle is better than a regular assault rifle. But you can't repair them with each other. I'm going to put away my duplicates in my house. You guess that was the key from the sheriff. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, always repair weapons with the matching item with the lowest condition. Oh, I've always done it with the highest and then combined the two lowest ones. Hi, D and Ollie. Okay, I, oh, I have a fat man here. <laughs> yeah, I should probably take that now. I'm probably never gonna wear this. It weighs 15, but just it's, I don't ever um, heal it up to be its full uh, DT rating. And I said I was putting something else away too. Oh yeah, my laser pistol. Hmm. Okay, yeah, I'll be fine. I should try roulette all in with my points. Hmm, I probably should at some point. Yeah, oh, I should have slept here. I do have a lot of points. I don't think I have the most, though. I think Dusty still has more, maybe? I'm not really sure what I did with my points. Okay, we're all healed, and maybe our robot friend has some more water for us. Good morning, madam. You what? got some water? I'm sorry, madam, my condom. You have. Okay, we're leaving. Um. Find a home for Brian. We'll do this Meyer Lurk one now. That's all the way over there, so... If I go to DuPont Northeast, I think that's the closest place. Mmm. 
There's a lot of raiders here. I don't know if I can get through here. This is where I um, started the game today. Maybe I can just... Oh, wait. Oh, what's this? <clears throat> oh god, this wants me to take... Uh, maybe I should go here instead. I can't fast travel when there's enemies nearby. What the fuck? Okay, I'll hide back over here. It actually wanted me to go through the metro. Still enemies. Okay. If I come and go... Hell is caution down here. I don't see anything. Fuck. Oh my god, let me fast travel. This sucks. Going over here might be far enough. Oh, that's bullshit. I'm gonna have to fight them then. So what are we working with then? I have a couple new things. So I've got my new assault rifle. That's gonna go on two. My 10 mil is still on one. I have a 10 mil submachine gun. That's better, I'll replace my one with that. Combat shoddy is going on five. I don't have anything for that. Ripper stays on three. Sniper will put on six. Stim's on four. Good. Oh, fuck, really? Really, where the hell are they? Really? You can shoot me through that? I don't believe it. <laughs> Hi, Kiani. Where the hell are they? I can see one talking to me through here. Oh. One little tip. When you go outside Megaton and wait for an hour, a couple times you will encounter roaming merchants. You can sell and buy stuff there as well. Okay. No, that's not a spoiler. Thank you, Dreamworks. That has nothing to do with the game. Or, to the story. I'll do it. Okay, I'm still too close to enemies to fast travel, I bet. I've just gotta sneak all the way through here. Oh god, there's a, gu a mine there. They're shooting me. Whoa, there's so many. Oh, look at that. There's ghouls, I think. Hmm, my weapon has broken after one fucking shot. What a piece of shit. Okay. I got it. Oh my god, there's mines here. Ah! Oh. Shit. Oh fuck! I can't fight this many. Oh, I'm fucking totally fucked here. I didn't think I would get surrounded like this. Holy crap. This is a super, super dangerous area. Maybe she has it already and doesn't want to open the box. No way. Oh, the higher your explosive skill is, the more time you have till a mine explodes. Uh, someone has said that before, and I was wondering if it was true or not. Zero deaths, zero deaths. Just kidding, those weren't real deaths, guys. I do want those mines, though. You want one of those saws for Thanksgiving? I believe that can be done. 
Oh, danger. Danger! <laughs> Gotta kill them before they kill me. Hey, it has a Ant-Man hat. I didn't save it. Oh, look, I do have frag. Oh, those are mines. I don't think I saved after equipping these, did I? Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> quickly loot, quickly loot, and leave. Ooh. I'm in danger. Don't know where they're coming from. Oh shit, there they are. Oh no, I have fucking ammo. Fuck. <laughs> Take a stim and a jet for extra AP. Drink all this nuka to heal me. Now, I could use the fat man. Oh, that would be beautiful. I'm probably gonna die anyway. So I'll do it. Oh, I'm behind a car. Holy fuck. Really? That one guy didn't die? <laughs> Get some more AP. Go back to our hunting rifle. I still have a chance. I'm gonna do a quick save here. When that guy peeks, I can vats him. Mm, too close. Here we go. Nice head armor. He has an AR. I could take out that arm. That gun's gonna fall out of your arm for sure. Oh yeah, there we go. I'm fine now. Oh. oh no, how did he pick it up again, you son of a bitch? He's almost dead! Yes! I'm in caution, but I'm no longer in danger. This is good. Let's do another save here. I'll take it all. And that. I like that helmet a lot. I'm probably gonna put that on. Okay, let's check out what we got here. I got three assault rifles. Means I can repair this one with that one. More hunting rifles. Currently for my hat, I'm wearing Sheriff's hat. Which doesn't really do much, so I'll put on the Arclight helmet. Oh wait, this one also has a cool look. No other helmets though. Paint spike armor is DT10, mine's DR9. Or DR10, yeah, so I should put this on and then repair it with the other ones. And then Sadist Armor might be better, let's see. It does DR10 as well, okay. We should just choose what looks cooler then. Well, this one is actually better because it's DR12, so I'll leave that on. Now let's see how cool I look. Oh, super fucking cool. Look how white I am. <laughs> this is terrible. I'm gonna burn! Now, did they have any food on them? Because I need to eat. No, they didn't. I'll save that stim for an emergency.
But I should investigate what these guys were guarding. Oh shit. I need to switch back to that AR. That's a lot better for this, but I'm really almost dead. One more? Yep. He's right around there. Or maybe not. Oh, maybe he's up in the building. See if it's a dead end or if you can go over top of this. Mm, maybe. No, it's feeling like an invisible wall to me. So the other guys are beyond there. That's fine, it was just a dead end, but often in dead ends there is like some loot. So maybe we'll see if we can go upstairs. No. And if you do it, you'll glitch. <laughs> that sounds fun. Oh no, I hear ghouls. They're all down there. That's fine. The place that I actually want to go to... Is that... Fuck. What? How do they have such perfect fucking accuracy? That's bullshit. I am leaving. Oh no, they're there too. Oh shit. Whoa, whoa, did you see that? That was a great effect. Let's see if she had any healing. Oh no. Oh no, that might blow up. A double? <laughs> that sucks. Good night, Timber. instead of turning that way, um, I'm gonna go the other way. Because <laughs> I think this whole area is a dead end. <clears throat> like, I won't actually be able to go beyond here. <clears throat> And Great Itch, I think, also was a dead end. So maybe Sewer Waste Station. As soon as I'm able to fucking fast travel out of here, I'll do it. There's three of them in there. I'm gonna have to just toss a nuke. Oh, dead bodies. What are these? Whiskey. Get back here. Oh, 
he was finding out how to get up here. Okay. Follow three looks harder now compared to the first day. <laughs> yeah. Alright, he's coming up here. I'm gonna give him a small welcoming party with my 10 millimeter SMG. Welcome! Okay, maybe now I'm safe. I can fast travel. Yeah, we can. Okay, so I should go to Super Deep Mine or Super Way Station. Because if I take Sewer Way Station, this is also on a road. But if I take that, that's right on the road. And I can just walk down and jump into the water. Yes. <laughs> Luckily, I don't have any spicy chips to punish me for deaths. That is where I crashed the other night. Yeah, I remember that, actually. Look, here's the water. Oh, shit. Is that Super Mutants? Son of a bitch. Hmm. Welp. I have killed them before, and I can also just probably avoid them. I'll go around. Yeah, no, fuck those jelly beans. I'm never eating those again. You guys can eat all the fucking disgusting jelly beans. Be my guest. I'll send them to you. If someone wants to eat them. Oh, Wilhelm's Wharf. Who's that? I was about to kill you! You fool, you look like a ghoul. Well, look at this. We got us a wanderer all the way out here in Wilhelm's Wharf. You must got some important business out here to be wandering around. Ain't none of my beeswax what you're doing. But if you're interested in trading, maybe we can help each other. Just don't talk about your taint anymore, Grandma Sparkle. And we have a deal. What are you doing out here? My boys are hunting lurks. Finest meat you could get, but he don't move around in your stomach like Mole Rack does. Ugh. Right dangerous, those things. Just as soon take your head off as look at you. Watch yourself out here. They're all over. Okay, is there anything going on here? Some fellas came out here a while ago that said they was looking for some do-gooder that came out from one of them vaults. Whoa! I told them I ain't seen nobody like that and sent them on their way. <laughs> they might still be around here, though, if you think you can help them. <laughs> That's not me. I was good to hear. Okay, she sells dog meat. Send it all to Angel Wang. Does it come with a Ruka? No. Not even a tiny Ruka. A teeny tiny Ruka. This little Ruka is all mine. And the big Ruka. <laughs> I've pissed off someone. Yes, I know. I can't believe they're looking for me. I didn't do anything. I'm just here being a good fella. have enough caps but that's fine oh why did I sell all that to her I did wasn't even fucking paying attention cancel she only had 10 caps to her name however HP plus 24 I do need to buy this that's that's my only way I can heal and still 
take that back. There we go. I'm giving her nine caps now. It's a trade. We'll see. Now let me at that Myrlark meat. Not bad, Grandma Sparkle. Grandma's cooler requires key, eh? Well, I bet Grandma keeps the key on her. Oh, and that shack. I could go in there. Okay, we're gonna... Wait till Grandma Sparkle's gone. Oh, okay. oh shit, she saw me go in. Oh, I'm not doing anything in here, Grandma Sparkle. Don't you worry about me. Ooh, locked easy. Very easy. Grandma Sparkle, it appears as though you've been raided. And I could sleep in her bed? Wow, I want some of these for my house. This is great. I didn't do it! <laughs> hey, my destination is right this way. It's the best way to get to it, I guess. There's the little island right there. That up there is a bit unfamiliar. You don't think those lights are fun when you're trying to sleep? <laughs> well, you need to make your life a little bit better in this horrible place. Holy fuck, those are mines! Okay, that's- this is my lucky day. Um... I'm gonna save. Right here. Oh! You gotta click it twice. Oh! <laughs> okay, one. What the fuck is that? That one looked a little bit different. What were they trying to guard this bridge from? Ooh, can't believe I got them all. That's a lot of free XP. This looks like the place. Anchorage Memorial. Okay. Oh, I thought I put my SMG on. There. Okay, we're ready. We don't know what's gonna be in here. But this has to be it, right? Let's check our quest. Let's 
Uh, place the observer in a spawning pod. Oh, shit. Optional, do not kill any Meyer lurks. Well, unfortunately, they have really good meat, it seems. So I think I'm gonna have to kill them. I just want all the free meat. She's not gonna give me anything good enough to make up for all that healing meat. Oh, what the fuck? Those are big! Oh, no. Oh, no. I forgot how big those are. Um... Where's its little face? Face. No, that's there. 10% for the fucking face. Hey, leg it is. Oh, shit. Okay. No, I just want your tasty meat! Oh fuck, I'm almost dead. That's not gonna make up for all the... <laughs> oh no. That's not gonna make up at all for all of the damage I just took there. Well, we'll see if it's worth it or not. I could just bomb the whole place. Oh no, Ted! Oh, that's not a hollow tape. The Mirelurks busted the storage area and have been raising hell through the whole facility. Price says the bastards get smarter every day. He says I'm paranoid, but I think someone might be sabotaging things around here. We've taken on so much extra health. I don't know who I can trust around here anymore. Things don't look too good. I don't think I'll be walking out of here, and I figure you should be the one to get our stash. I managed to get it hidden pretty well, in case something like this happened. I don't want any of these damn fools tripping over it, so I threw a couple of curves in, but it's nothing you can't handle. Start with my terminal, log in, follow instructions. For some reason you've forgotten the password, you might want to sit down and have a think with a nuka cola if you catch my drift. If this damn meat weren't in such high demand, I'd have pulled out of this racket before the word go. I got too greedy. Okay. Great. I think there's probably one right behind that door. Shit, it's locked average. Give me your meat, my lurk. Don't know where it is. Fucking gnome. Hell. Oh, nice, I can sleep here, good. I can't sleep when there's enemies nearby, okay. So I gotta kill this Myrlark then. Wherever it is. Oh. Okay, it's right up there. <laughs> I think it's fragmine time, guys. It's above no there is this. 
Shit. Oh god, what if it comes through there? Oh fuck. Cripple its leg. That's gonna hurt me too. Oh fuck, of course there's one right there. I'm almost dead. I need to eat their meat. The only way I would have been able to do this without killing them is um, if I had stealth voice. Uh, the auto click phenomenon where you click on a chest locker out of habit when you read empty. Yeah, I even though I read it, it's like your finger just acts faster. It's like a muscle memory thing. I'm gonna eat their meat, don't worry. Just hope there's no more of these shitty Meyer lurks. Looked at those already. Oh, there's a work bench here. One more blade. The thing is, I don't have any recipes for anything. It is suggesting that I could make something here. Motorcycle thing and leaf blower. I don't know how to make shit. I wonder how I unlock that ability. Okay, I'll click save here. I wasn't sure if I was gonna actually be killing the Myrlex or not on this one. I'm going to remove that. So I've got two here. Doesn't specifically say my destination. It says go to their spawning pot. I believe that's down below. I saw it through one of these areas. Maybe not this room. Hmm. Hi, Space Racer. Oh, maybe I can sleep now. There are no enemies nearby. Great. Let's sleep just five hours. And hopefully they don't regenerate. Oh, I need to buy the diagrams. You can buy the shish kebab diagram. Okay. Yeah, I'll probably get that. We're feeling a lot better since getting rested. Oh, here. This is where I fought them. Oh, shit. They are here still. Mm, I don't have enough mines to kill them. Only one. This might be the case of the Ripper. We can... Ripper in the face, or waste all of our ammo. Oh, what else would be good? Probably a shotgun, I think. Shotguns usually have good armor um, penetration. And these things are armored. Thanks, Minito. <clears throat> Hopefully they're also fucking deaf. And oh god, they're not. Shit. Oh, where are they?
Oh, they know how to use stairs, I think. Oh shit, yes they do. Okay, get the enough projectiles, my alert. Oh fuck. No! Oh, it's putting its fucking head down. Oh, uh, that does a okay amount of damage. Uh oh. oh god. Yeah, right in the face. Here we go. 50%. Oh god, we crippled its face. No, it's pissed off! Myrlark, I just want to eat your meat! You're tasty! Soft shell crab meat! Ah! There. Okay, where's its other friend? I would like to do a Myrlark cosplay. <laughs> I wonder if anyone ever has. Yeah, I'm just worrying about going down there. I don't know how I'm gonna get back up. Oh, Jesus, it's right there. Well, this is a great opportunity. Um, look up at me, Marlurk. I want to see your beautiful face. It works. Everyone will just think you're a crab. Yeah, definitely. I that was cheese, I know. So cheesy. Looks like few of them wanted the muck, but they deserve it. Hope you have a great Thanksgiving. Thanks for being a great interactive streamer. Thank you, DJZ, and thank you for being generous to my stream. I appreciate it. I hope you guys have a nice Thanksgiving. It's actually Canadian Thanksgiving happened uh, last month, but you guys have it this month, so thank you. <clears throat> well, I killed them all. I um, have to put this device somewhere. Oh, look, he's even just keels over the thing like that. Where the fuck do I put this thing? Maybe I don't have it selected as a quest. Place the observer in a spawning pod. Or spawning pond. Pod. What else can I do to these pods? Oh, ho, ho, look at this. HP plus six. Free. I'll take it. Free meat. Get a stew going. Free is free. I wonder if I should look down there. I bet there's something special and magical down here. Probably just a pond of Myrlurk shit, but you never know. If I was a developer, this is where I'd put a really good game. Same. Or a really good. Ooh. Thank you, dude. I was just saying, this is where I think that they would put a very good gun. I appreciate that. Thanks, dude. Really. Very nice of you. <laughs> I'm glad that you guys like my stream. I try to be as, as interactive as possible, but sometimes we get a little carried away fist fighting ants. And stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna go back upstairs. And then we're gonna go into this other door that I saw right here. Yeah, this one. But not before saving. And just double check. Return to Moira. Yeah. Now let's eat all that succulent baby hatchling Myrlark meat. Disgusting. Okay, I came from there. This looks promising. A nice little office here. Got it. This desk has something. Mm, I can't open anything. I have below average lock picking and terminal skills. Oh, that could have been the way down that I should have taken before. <laughs> Did 
There's never anything in here. Oh, there is something. I didn't check the wall of the other bathroom, though. We're done here, I guess. Uh, but I don't see a, an outdoor exit from here. Just a way back down there. Mm. Oh god, where is it taking me now? This is not what I signed up for. Now we're probably going into real Mirelurk territory. come here. I'll let me eat a bunch of your children in front of you. That'll surely help. Fuck. What's gonna work on this guy? A fat man? Combat shotgun is my highest damage. 29. I'm gonna ruin it by using it here. Oh, we could use the ripper. <laughs> okay, that's a possibility. The ripper. Or 10 millimeter, 30 bullets. After I um, after I let this loose, we're gonna use the ripper. Oh, the! I gotta take care of that other uh, Myrlurk here first. Oh fuck. Okay. Now AR time, I guess. out of that ammo now, okay. Now what? I have a bottle cap mine. Oh, I should have used this. Um, Thanksgiving is the one day a year that I eat meat. A whole turkey. Yeah, a whole fucking turkey by myself. 24 pounds of meat. But Dr. Snake thinks you mean tofu turkey, which would also be true. I, I do sometimes try turkey on Thanksgiving and it's pretty good. It's not anything I would eat more than, like, once a year. Well, I guess we're using this fucking combat shotgun. Eat it! Eat it, Meyer Lurk! Oh, fuck, I'm almost dead. Okay, bear. That big daddy is coming in here right away, though. I gotta... I gotta make a plan. I need, uh, two stims at least. Some jet to recoup that AP. Some scotch to just because I need some scotch. And now we're gonna use the bottle cap mine. Oh fuck, where is it? Ah! Ah! It's almost dead! Holy shit, it just standing there looking at me. This is not gonna be a fast enough gun. I'm gonna use my um, trusty combat shotgun. How do you like that silver? <laughs> and my weapon broke right there. Lucky me. Really, he didn't have anything that great. Holy crap, what am I getting myself into, you guys? Soft shell Myrlurk meat is what I thought I was getting before. We're going back in. <laughs> Hopefully there's not a queen viral lurk in there. We've seen those before in Fallout 4 and those were not fun. I had to use a fat man on a queen viral lurk.
Mm. Uh oh. Oh no. What am I doing? Yes, right in the fucking face. That's what you get for aiming your face at me. <laughs> that was a perfect shot. Hi, Shaman X. It's so good that they drop such nice meat because I wouldn't be able to survive down here without it. Radiation level. Oh shit, I have advanced radiation poisoning. I wonder if I got any right away. Just red resistance. Well, I guess that's all I can do. Oh wait, no, I had red X right there. Fuck, I just took it. It's rad right away that I need. Holy fuck. Oh my god, an underwater Myrlurk place? That is a bad idea, I think. It didn't take me anywhere, it was just a small pond. to leave. Cool. Great. I've got advanced radiation sickness. I need to get the hell out of here. We will go right back to Moira. And also the doctor to cure our radiation. What do you think you're doing? I always forget where she is. You don't need bats as much as in 4. I didn't really find that you needed bats a ton in 4, but depending on what you were doing. Oops. Hi, Connor. And two other names that I'm sorry I can't read because they're in Russian. <laughs> Are they intelligent? Do they have a leader? Some sort of king or priests or some sort of scaly community center? Um, <laughs> I set the observer, but I don't think they'll forget my visit anytime soon. Oh no, 
You didn't rile them up, did you? Because I'm not getting a very good signal from the observer. Whoops. I think they buried it in the mud. Oh, I really hope that was just mud. Anyway, you saw them, at least a bit. What are your observations about them? Strength between shells and scales. They're pretty tough, but not tough enough. Yeah, okay. Easier to avoid them than to fight them, you mean? Sounds like a good idea. Shame it's apparently hard to do in their den. I wish we could have gotten more information, but this will have to do for the book. Here's your pay. Maybe they'll help you be sneakier next time. <laughs> Four stealth boys, excellent. Okay, is that all we need to do for the second chapter? Absolutely. I'm glad to finish it up, but I bet you're even happier, right? Just one last chapter now, and it's much safer, I promise. <laughs> oh, and here's your payment. Oh. Two big boxes full of ammo. Think of it as insurance, in case the next chapter isn't as safe as I predict. That's some ammo. Okay, thank you. That's it? All right, let's do the last chapter. The last chapter is a bit more esoteric. It's about the survival of humanity as a whole and how to rebuild society. Deep stuff, huh? We need to know how large settlements are formed, how to harness the old technology, and I'll need you to get ancient history from a nearby library. We're in the last stretch now, so let's finish it up strong. What's first? Ooh, local history, old technology. Could check the library. Old technology sounds good. It does, doesn't it? I mostly just deal with it after it's junked, but a trader gave me this Robco processor widget. He said it's worth a fortune. According to him, if it's connected to the mainframe in the Robco factory, you could have access to all the robots you'd ever want. Now that would be a great example of how to harness technology, wouldn't it? I would definitely like to go to Robco. Okay. Yeah, you should just be able to plug it into the mainframe at the Robco production facility. It'll give you access to the robots and terminals. Okay, here. And be sure to keep an eye peeled for any other examples of how to make old technology work for you out there. Cool. Okay, let's talk about the robots. Fiddle with any interesting technology lately? Well, why not go over there and make a few friends? Or activate them, I guess. Okay. I've been thinking about your experiments. Can I ask you something personal? Why, I'm flattered. What would you like to know? Um... Why are you always working on such weird ideas? Well, look around at the world we live in. It may be okay to you, but I've read about what it used to be like. And this wasn't it. So we all need something that keeps us going, despite all the terrible things around us. For me, it's things like this book. Crazy experiments are what keep you going. <laughs> no, it, it's like, uh, did you ever try to put a broken piece of glass back together? Even if the pieces fit, you can't make it whole again the way it was. But if you're clever, you can still use the pieces to make other useful things. Maybe even something wonderful, like a mosaic. Well, the world broke, just like the glass. And everyone's trying to put it back together like it was. But it'll never come together the same way. Hmm. So you're trying to make the world better than it was? Hey, it sounds crazy when you say it that way. But that's what I'm aiming for. Yeah. The Wasteland Survival Guide isn't much toward that lofty goal, but it's an important one. And that's why I need your help. I don't think I can do it alone. Okay. Um. You got cap? I hope I have some caps. She does seem like the most positive person so far, really, <laughs> that we've been meeting. Everyone's a little, a little depressed. Hello, Neeraj. Um, Moira Brown's sanity is teetering on the edge. She's just very innocent or something. Okay, what I want... 
prepared. Uh, I broke my shotgun. Completely. Combat shotgun, that's gonna cost 218. I don't have that. So, what did I pick up in the wasteland here that I could sell her? An extra AR? Uh, wow, she really doesn't give me very good value for this. 126. If I was a min-maxer like I kind of was in 4, I would be wearing the barter clothes to do this. Was that my good leather armor? That was DT-12, and what am I currently wearing? I'm wearing pain spike armor, which is DT-11. I'll just take that back. Ooh, barter plus five. Here it is. Shit. I don't know if that would make such a big difference. Um... You agree this female is the most positive? Yeah, <laughs> she is. It sounds like she's trying very hard not to go postal. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> okay. So she's only giving us 59. It's not really going to be enough for the stims that I need. Good hunting. Dope. She wants us to go to Robco, which has always been fun in the other fallouts. Now, do I have an issue? Radiation poisoning, yeah, definitely. I've gotta buy some right away. Or at least maybe get this guy to heal it all at once. Well, that's a patient. You came in here on your own power. Sure can. Hundred caps! Can. Let's see what he sells to do it, because I doubt I can do it for a hundred caps myself. Radway will give- oh, rads minus a hundred for twenty-eight. Oh, maybe it will. Because I have like four hundred-ish rads. I need to buy that anyway. Uh, oh, I think... No, his stims aren't cheaper. Shit. Yeah. You done? Good. Yeah. Bye. That might be exactly what I need. Oh, shit! No, it wasn't! Okay, I'm gonna put on the medicine jacket. Um, here it is. Science. Shit, where is it? Science plus 10? That's not... Med plus 5. I think that's the best I got. That will help. Um, right away. 104? Not really good. Well, it didn't enough. I am now sick with minor red poisoning, and then now I'm okay. Great, let's leave. Good to see that Brahmin is still alive. I would not kill this Brahmin. Look how friendly it is. Okay, we have a bunch of other quests to do. So, install the widget at the Robco. One thing I wanted to do was deliver Lucy's message. I got this early on, and that's pretty far away, actually. So we're gonna fast travel to Vault 101 and walk there. Is that Vault 101? Yeah. I thought of going back in there. 
since that girl that I know is still alive in there, probably. But they might kill me, since I kind of left on a bad note, sort of. I kind of murdered her father. These raiders right here are easy pickings. I killed them really easily at the beginning of the game. They're pretty low level. But they've got some stuff, and they still give me full XP for the kill. There is a few more here. Whoa, he also has an AR. Hello. Means he'll probably have some ammo, too. Oh fuck, I'm still wearing this dumbass suit, that's why I'm gonna die. I need to put back my, um... Sadist is 10, that's 11. I thought my leather was 12, yeah. There we go, and I won't die. Whoa, 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 that person's glitching out, holy shit. Oh my god. I really have to hope that they have ammo, because I'm so low still. Also, not even wearing a fucking helmet. making sure that I can repair this stuff. I think that one had a higher DR. No, they're all 12. Okay, so I've got to go this way. With my four bullets. Hey, Velvet. Uh, art play. There will be a fallout, or there was a fallout 4. <laughs> I've already done 4 and New Vegas. So we're gonna go investigate this barn first, after we save. <gasps> hey! Friendlies! Weapons, it. What are you doing around. here? You'll stay out of this if you know what's <gasps> good for you. Slaves? We found that water, and we're keeping it. Oh no, my speech sucks. Why don't we all split it? There's really no point getting killed for it. Yeah, you're probably right. That's lucky. Besides, just as likely you'd wait for us to finish each other off, then take it all for yourself. Whoa. Get out of here. Okay, thanks a lot. Well, I should kill them, they have guns. Hey. Yeah, yeah. What, 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 what? Who's shooting me? Oh, red scorpions. Oh, purified water. You think it's funny how poor I am? No ammo, gear is broken, no caps? Well, I like to live dangerously. Oh, look, a mini nuke! I like to use what I have and not... not hoard it too much. Oh, he fell asleep with a hunting rifle. Activate ham. What's this? Huh. Great. See you guys later. I took all your purified water. 
Let's see, that's just uh, the same gun as I have. Hunting rifle, hunting rifle. Hey, hey. You got what you came for. You got what you came for. You got what you came for. Why don't you move on? I'm not looking for any new friends. Is there anything in this silo? No. Oh, wait. Mm, no. Okay, we're gonna deliver this letter. It's gonna be great. Oh, there's some nice trailers down there. And I might see a swing set. And who's that? A robot. Hey, Heidi. You are so glad I streamed. You would die of boredom in the hospital right now. Are you working or are you admitted? Oh no, he's not friendly! Oh no. Oh no, I'll hide behind this pole. He can't possibly shoot me behind this. <laughs> Protectron. He protect, but he also attacks! energy cell and fission battery. Hi, Hemp Knight. He shoots like a stormtrooper. You're a patient! Oh my god, Heidi, I hope you're okay. Hopefully not for too long. Well, if you haven't caught up, I have, um... Two other follow through. What the fuck is that? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What is that? Is that Yao Guai? <laughs> Heidi, if you haven't seen, I, I streamed this two other times, so you got another 10 hours of follow three. Oh shits and oh no's. <laughs> you got a minigun. Congratulations. So early. What am I gonna do? This big fucking bear. <sighs> I got no ammo again. Hey, dude. Thank you for sponsoring me. I appreciate that. For the last 10 minutes of the stream, you will show up right there. Latest sponsor. If I set it up correctly. Thank you. I appreciate it. Welcome to the Golden Ruka Club. Now when you talk in YouTube, you'll have a little Golden Ruka next to your name. And you have access to four exclusive emojis. Soon to be more. Yay, Golden Ruka. Yeah, I love the Golden Ruka. I'm glad to hear that, Heidi, and I'm... I'm sad to hear that you're not well. Do I use a fat man against the bear? Or frag mine? Or a hunt- I think a hunting rifle you would use against a bear, right? Like, this is not gonna be good. Okay. Okay, left, okay. Alright, oh, oh, it's far enough away I can use the fucking- Wait, I'm just gonna try this first to see how much damage it does. Oh no. Oh my! Ah! I didn't save! I should add those emojis to Discord too, that's right. What am I gonna do? The Ripper? You guys. Oh, good thing I have all this Myrlark meat. I'm gonna be fine. No problem. As soon as this thing runs away, I'm tossing a nuke at it. No, no! No, it's not rip yet. No, 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 no. I got a... I got a plan, you guys. Gonna get all high first. <laughs> I'm gonna get so fucking high that this bear doesn't even want to touch me. There we go. Ripper, go. 
No, no! Oh, no! He died! Knocked it out of my hand! Get out of here! No, Yao Guai, no! Bad dog! Bad dog! Bad, bad bear! Oh, my God. Okay, that didn't work. How about the Batman? Oh, uh, no, it's not time for the... It's not time. Oh, get on the UFO. Good idea. I'll try. Let's eat all the Meyer Lurk meat. <laughs> A little bit of vodka for my nerves. <laughs> and then... The 32 pistol. Let the cheese flow through you. Feel the cheese. Where's the UFO? Oh god, I'm getting in the UFO. I'm on. Oh, look at you, you stupid fucking- No! What? <laughs> he didn't! He didn't even touch me! You guys. <laughs> I'm gonna be better prepared <laughs> next time. <laughs> Hi, Flames. I didn't see you there. <sighs> Just wait. I'm gonna get this Yao Kwai son of a bitch. Leave that Protectron alone. Oh, there he is. Okay, we're gonna nuke it. We're gonna save the bear by nuking it. So let's do this. Batman, there we go. Oh, I don't think so, Red Scorpion. I don't think you should come near me right now. I'm holding a fucking nuclear weapon. Oh, why don't you just fuck off? I don't want to ruin my perfectly good ripper on you. I'll use the air. You stupid shit bug. Okay, maybe it's a little bit of ripping action. Just a little bit. You broke my ripper! I'm gonna punch this shit out of you, you stupid bug! God, my unarm skill sucks. Oh my goodness. One little sliver of health left. Let's get ready. I used all my stims on that rad scorpion. There is the bastard. Kinda hit chance do I have zero, alright. Getting warmer. I just want this thing to go away. I just want to go and kill that Yao Guai in peace. Help me kill 
Really, you fucking escaped slaves? What are you doing to each other? Really? <laughs> there we go. Not my problem anymore. Yeah, the stream is ending pretty soon, but we're gonna make sure. I didn't actually mean to do that. No, no, no. No. Okay, I'm saving. Mmm, <laughs> lure the scorpion to the bear and hope they don't like each other. No. Don't even think about it. Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, no! Whoops. Well, that one will live to tell the tale. Now. Is this one gonna be pissed at me? I'm just gonna leave it alone. Or we'll harvest. His brothers. So that they don't go to waste. Okay. Now where is... This Yao Goai? Oh, Protectron, what are you doing down there? That's not where you're supposed to be. Brahmin? Okay. Enclave I bought. I'm not seeing it yet, boy. They were bad cows anyway. Thank you. I'm not gonna nuke this fucking scrub. Oh, I don't even have ammo. Mm. This protectron sucks. I just don't think it deserves to use a nuke on it. Hmm. But I don't really have any other option, do I? Oh, I have a tire iron. Oh, and a sniper rifle. We'll use this. Oh, my fucking weapon is broken. Wow. Excellent quality. Okay. I'm coming to fix you, Protectron. Fix you up real nice. Stay still. Do not attempt to flee. Okay. Now I gotta watch, because the Yagwai could come out of anywhere. You can't really know where it's gonna be because it just popped out of nowhere before. What I need right now is a nice place to hide. Should it show up? What if I go in here? I bet it can't come in here to kill me. Well, actually, I bet it probably could. He's gone. I think I might have to go to go to sleep. Oh, look at this pre-war money just sitting here. They left all their food out. Maybe that's why there's fucking bears around here. It's irresponsible campers.
Another Protectron, really? He's just looking for a picnic basket. Hey, Protectron. I'm coming to fix you. Violence will not be tolerated. <laughs> and submit to <laughs> Hey, we're gonna go have a nap inside that trailer over there and see and uh, hopefully Yaguai will come back. Megan is saving everyone from mad ramen disease, yeah. Exactly. Okay, we'll do a quick save here. I think it might take like a good 24 hours for the Yagua to come back. Hopefully he doesn't eat us in our sleep. The Megan spin cheese technique. Yeah, it is really working. <laughs> and it is 10 o'clock, but we're gonna see. If he's here, we nuke him. If he's not, we end the stream. And Yogi. Too bad. The nuke didn't go to waste, but we will come in. Don't forget the all in Ruka. I never said I was doing that. <laughs> If there is one plus hour to the stream, mm, not today. <laughs> I have to eat. Let's do a little save here, and that worked. That's true, Welder. <laughs> Very special occasions. Okay, save worked. I see the quick save logo. You just have to double check because I am a bit paranoid. I heard that sometimes saves do get broken if you do, if you do too many auto saves and not proper saves. So I might actually be backing up my saves um, as well after this. What you have to eat? Oh yes. <laughs> so you guys, I hope you liked my stream today, and I hope you had fun. I think we're probably going to do it again tomorrow. I uh, This game is awesome, and I like it just as much as New Vegas and Fallout 4. It's more similar to me than New Vegas. Or it's more similar to New Vegas, yeah, than it is a 4, obviously, because I know they're the same engine and everything. But it's also just a little bit darker and a bit gloomier, which I like, too. New Vegas was very happy and everyone I, I found vegas like the new vegas itself to be kind of boring i didn't really do very much in the casinos but this i am interested and i actually um am pretty interested in the main quest so i hope that you guys will come back tomorrow and i'd like um to thank a few of you for being generous to my stream today thank you very much dude for sponsoring my youtube channel Thank you, do dude again for the super chat. And thank you, DJ Z. And of course, Fun at Home for being on the mug all night. Fun at Home, thank you for being so generous. It is so appreciated. Uh, New Vegas is like DLC. Well, it was a whole game. It was an excellent game in its own right. But I, I'm kind of liking this one. Um, thank you, Guy Perps, as well. And Angel Wang. Thank you, guys. <laughs> oh, you are still here, fun at home. Thank you very much. No, New Vegas wasn't boring at all. It was just different, like, um, compared to this. This just feels a little rougher, and maybe maybe that's kind of what I like about it. I Don't get me wrong, I fucking love New Vegas, um, but it's just a little different. So, good night, everyone. Good night, Aya. Uh, I will see you guys tomorrow. Do come back, and please don't forget, I have a Discord channel, and an Instagram, and a Twitter, and a Steam group as well. The links are below 
the channel or below the video on YouTube, you'll see them. And you will also see them in chat if I put in some chat commands. So have a wonderful evening, guys. See you tomorrow. We'll play more of this. And thank you very much for watching me.